<laughs> D22, what are you doing? Um, I've, I've stepped back and put my hat off to let Alexi go through first the door, so Alexi closer. would do the exact same thing so I imagine we'd both stand there for a second awkwardly yeah <laughs> rock paper scissors quickly <laughs> it's happened again what the d pushes Alexi firmly but kindly through the door before him <laughs> and hello, welcome to Live to Dice. My name is Matt Bateman. So good. Good to see you. Uh, we're joined. Oh my god, we're wearing green against green backdrops, guys. Shit. We're joined by the sleep deprived Sasha Burgoyne, the groggy guy Samuels, the restless Rose Red on, and of course, the drowsy David Cox. Uh, we left the end of last week uh, in a state of exhaustion, uh, with some some a little bit some a little bit more than others. But that's all right. I'm going to perk up right now. Got a bit of coffee, kicking off. Um, who answered last week's question though? I think it was Guy. Yeah, I David asked. asked the I question asked the question. Guy. guy answered yeah, it. Yeah, so Guy answered it. Oh. Guy, you get to roll the d4 this time. So you okay. you are you are you know. Great. Let's do it. Four. That is Sasha. No. Yeah. <laughs> no. Guy um, asks you the question. No, 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 I have to ask the question. Okay. But I have not thought of another one since my last one, because I'm an idiot. Um... Crisps. <laughs> Is that your question? <laughs> I, 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 yes, that question was what I want crisps. Do you have crisps? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> great, good stuff. We've really learned a lot about That's our characters. That's great. We've come, come together a lot more. Yeah. Mayway really could go for Okay, I'm just going to ask the same question I asked before, but to Mayway, because that was who I originally wanted to ask it to, but I had to ask Please it to Please refresh Alexi. my mind, my love. Um, if Mayway had to get a tattoo, what would it be? Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Did I answer? <laughs> An ear. Uh, yours is a, a book with wings? Or like, no, it was like a scroll with wings and like had like... I love reading or something like that. I can't quite remember. Oh, okay. Something, something oh my god! Is... I don't know. That's a really, that's a really hard question. Because I, like, have to or like would have because she's very much the kind of person to just get drunk and be like, yeah, give me, give me a tattoo. So it could be anything. Yeah. Um, so it's an I love mum tattoo. It's a butterfly on the lower back. Yes. Yeah, I was going to say, it's a tram stamp. <laughs> now be, be careful, because this could be canon. No, no. <laughs> Get a pass out drunk. It's just a single Olynthian crystal, like on, on, the lower, on the lower back. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> God. Um, I'd say that she would probably have uh, one newer and one older. Yep. Uh, Eye of Ayun on each arm. Oh, I like that. yeah, cool. And when did you get them? Um, so, hmm, probably one a couple of years before joining the library, mm -hmm. and one when she actually like was stationed there. Nice. David, are you okay? Yeah. I just thought of what Mayway's personal tramp stamp would be. Go on then. And what would it be? It's just the word hello on your lower back. <laughs> <laughs> Someone can go, oh, hello. Right. <laughs> All right, and Finnis, what, 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 what is Alexi's tramp stamp going to be then? If, if we go, we go on that route. Oh. <laughs> I don't think you'd answer this. I feel like the other should answer for you. <laughs> I, it's, oh, I, I think I know. I think I know what it would be. <laughs> uh, it's probably just either the crest or the signet ring of Hal's cast up. <laughs> See, my thing was just or on, be... the, on the base of his dick. <laughs> Dude, come on! <laughs> it's a tramp stamp. See, I was gonna be a deep V, but the deep V is an arrow pointing down. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah, no, it's like a guideline. So anytime you're doing your shirt up, if you can't way. see the line, yeah. you go, like, oh, no, wait, undo a button. Okay, there we go. Yeah, just, <laughs> just a small cross. <laughs> ah, there we are. Yeah. That's the point. Yeah. Well, mm. things are in a lighter spirits uh, than last time because I, I, I don't plan on killing anyone today. So we'll see, we'll see how they last. You know? So you do plan on killing us sometimes. Uh, yeah, eventually. Yeah. I feel like, you know, you've, you've, you've had it coming for a long time. We plan on killing yeah. someone. Uh, what about our characters? Do you plan on killing them at all? Uh, we'll, we'll see. We'll cool. see. Yeah, he thinks about that a lot less, you know. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> I'll do something about Alexi at some point. Anyway, Woo! pour yourself a drink. Uh, it's hot out. Settle so in uh, and get ready for so episode 18 yeah. of Who Lives Who Dice.
And hello. Our friends have barely escaped with their lives. Waltzing into the last pick, they soon realized it was in fact a point of meeting and control for Sarah Cave Fury. A tense fight broke out, and the Dwarven Mage merely toyed with the party while his cronies whittled down their health, aided by the perverted Rylinkium device Sarek had designed. Destroying the device brought a sudden end to the fray, but not without killing, not without nearly killing both of the Snow Elves in the process, and costing Mayway her heir. Escaping in the chaos, news quickly spread that Sarek had fled into the mountains, and as they rest, taking refuge just outside the town, D22 saw a cavalry of dwarves on horseback riding directly into the mountains. Exhausted, the party wakes up in a long abandoned shack, the grey winter sun peeking through the many broken wood walls. What happens next? Uh, Alexi will quickly wake up and go, <laughs> Uh, t- 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 sorry, uh, b- 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 bad dream. Um, thought you were in danger. <laughs> I mean, we might be. Um, it's hard to tell, but uh. not immediate danger. Seem to be doing. Yep, got all my limbs. Lovely. Um, I'm. I'm going to uh, see about how. How are you? I don't. I don't feel like I slept. No, you don't mm. look like you mm-hmm. slept very much. Uh. Mayway, you're awake, still exhausted, Uh and with a very pounding, reverberating headache as well. My love, can you, can you, I feel really, I feel really crap. Can, can you help me on my own? Um. You gave me a berry that tasted really good yesterday. Oh, I thought you meant, like, give you a, Pat on the back or something. Yeah, sure. Um, uh, uh, so Myla will um, just hold up her hands and already in the mirror pile of good berries. All right. I Go take, ahead. I take one. Mm-hmm. Does it ease my headache a bit? It, it energizes you a little bit, and it's the first proper good food you've you've had in the last day, and especially mm-hmm. after the night you've just had. Um, it settles you a little bit, and the headache fades, but tiredness remains. Um, Alexi, do you want one? Oh, um, well, I, 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 I don't, I don't want to wa- waste it. I don't, I don't. Oh, there's a lot. Ah, uh, yeah. sure. Go ahead. Uh, there you D. I know it does nothing. Yes, the, why not? Uh, D D twenty two has not looked away from the window, watching the road this entire time. You turn, being acknowledged now for the first time. Mm-hmm. What have you been doing for the last? <laughs> Um, I've been tinkering with my with my shoulder. Mm. Um, he's been uh, invigorated from the recent battle. He's decided to uh, harness his uh, Eldritch Cannon, and he's created a little slot in his shoulder now, um, where the cannon just raises up out of the you, shoulder. Why are you winking? And fires. <laughs> because I just gave him that idea. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, and without me. So he's just he's just been just been playing with that and kind of checking himself as you do sometimes in the in the reflection. Of the glass, very nice. kind of um, very nice modelling around, and he's kind of he's mulling <laughs> over a fantastic chat he had with Alexi mm. um, in the last session. He, um, yeah, he feels a little bit funny and a little bit warm inside, and he doesn't know why. Oh. Can you just make a perception check, please, just for the just for the night that's passed, so Certainly. we can see how much you actually <coughs> saw. So you saw quite a lot, I think. Eighteen. Eighteen. Yeah. So with with an eighteen, you kept a pretty close watch after the cavalry. Disappeared into the mountains, and Alexi, you, you did see that as well. Alexi soon dropping off. The road stayed fairly quiet. The old horse, the old carriage coming through. Um, you did at some point. You can still see the town just down the road. It's only four, maybe five miles in the distance. So, despite being dark, the moonlight did light up, and you did see some quite large figures by the gate, accepting what seemed to be a shipment at some point. Mm-hmm. Beyond that, it's been relatively quiet through the evening, relatively safe. No, no real noise or anything to report of. But at least right now, things seem okay. Mm-hmm. What? How is everyone feeling? Oh, tired. Oh. Um, you yeah. have managed to sleep, no? I don't feel like I did. What happened? Um, well... Um, who? 
bandaged my head. Uh, yeah, that 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 would have been me. Uh, you, you, and you're, then me. Uh, yeah, yeah, yes. Um, you're going to want to leave leave that on for a bit. Uh, but we should. What happened? Perhaps we could upgrade your head. Uh, mm, let, let's. Um, yeah, that that looks amazing, would, by the like way. The shoulder? That looked really good. Um, yeah. When did you do that? Uh, while everyone was sleeping. You didn't sleep either. I have been watching, watching oh. the roads. Oh. You should have woken me up. I'd have taken over. Yeah, That's okay. me. I had a lot to think about, and was able to upgrade. Oh, amazing. Um, Mayway, uh, did, how, how much do you remember of the fight? I mean, uh, I broke the chandelier, y- and yes. well, Mala wasn't doing so well. You were fighting Sarek, and oh, I barely remember fighting Sarek. He basically appeared, and then it kind I... of all went black until I got up when D was over me. Yeah, I, I woke up with I think Alexi over me. Yeah, yes. and um, and I couldn't really <coughs> hear anything. I guess the explosion. Not me silly, and we found some things, and then we left. Why did we not go and stay with the blacksmith? Well, we did. We did go, but um, we, we tried. Didn't stay. But he didn't like Alexi very much, so oh. we had to leave. Okay. Uh, well, we need to go. We after Sarek. We we we, we, we do, but we, we we need to um we we, we need to re- regroup and 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 rest. Um, mm. there isn't an easy way to say this. Oh God, what happened? All the Rylinthium exploded. Um, yeah, from the, 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 did Sarek explode? No. Uh, His he, arm did? He, he yes, oh. he's, miss, he's missing an arm. <laughs> out. Um, oh. As, as Alexi says the word exploded, something suddenly triggers in your mind and you think back, hearing the scream, seeing the oven <coughs> ghosts raise into the air as you drifted in and out of consciousness at that point, and you remember feeling an immense pressure on your air before passing out completely. I had the strangest dream when I went down. I saw ghosts. You saw ghosts? Happen? Did that happen? Yes. Really? I mean, yes, there, there, there were... Wait, we did see that, mm-hmm. right? Yeah. You, I thought the townspeople were being weird. You saw that. Um, you you were you were down. Um, it was it was just the two of us. Oh my um, god, you went down too. Yeah. Yes, there was a very terrifying moment in particular where our bag of holding was split open and we almost lost our stuff. But that that, that that's 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 not important. Um. The, we the, found the stuff afterwards, the, and we carried. We don't have a bag holding. Them. We we yeah, don't. We were, holding, we were carrying things. I, rem- I remember that. Um, I remember that. Mayway. Ah. Uh? It, it's it's okay. We'll we'll find some ma- magic that'll that'll fix it. I promise. Um. The ghost. No, you're. You're. Carefully, your ear. The other one. It's your right ear. Yeah. I can, f- I can feel this one beneath the. Wait. Um. Did my ear get cut off? Uh. What was your earring made of? Oh. 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 Um. Um. I'm lucky to be alive. <sighs> Tell me I don't have any. Well, 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 well um, I, I, I mean, I'm to, to my un- understanding. Two just un- unscrews a side bolt with his hand, hands over here. <laughs> and maybe I just burst out laughing out of like exhaustion. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, I, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not the most. Um... <sighs> Sarah K. Fury owes me a fucking <laughs> ear. Yes, yes. Um, but we we will we'll, we'll, we'll find um, um, uh, someone who can uh, restore it. Uh, the, the magic like like that exists, doesn't it? I I think so. Yeah. Oh my god. Um, I'm the worst librarian ever of the Vale. You're you're not. You're you're really not. You're really not. How, how many times did has he gotten away? He's he's so much more. Powerful than we are. Mayway, 
all the other snow elves who've gone up against him are dead. You're the only one that's we don't know. survived. We don't know if they're dead. He, he said as much. And I'm having encountered him? I'm not surprised. I think we only survived because there's four of us. Whereas I expect the library's been sending single agents like yourself? Or single, a- uh, based on what, what, what we heard, um, single agents with a, a, a warforged. Yeah. There must be a benefit of fighting as a team. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you and I would both be dead if the other two weren't here. No, we, we, Thank you. We, we wouldn't have let anything happen to you. What do we do now, Alexi? Um, well, I've, I've, I've been having a think. Um, I, I, I think, well, f- for now, uh, we, we should uh, re- rejuvenate for a little bit. Um, so it will, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. And Alexi just puts his hand on Mayways. Like, we'll, we, we will, I promise. We'll, we'll get to the bottom of it. We'll, we'll, we'll get him. And um, so I, I, I think uh, we, we could stay here and try and. Well, My, Myla has food, and my flask still has a bit in, so I, I'm not, I'm not worried about food. Um, we can maybe stay here, wait for things to settle down, and then. Uh, this, 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 this other kill. top is near here, isn't it? Kill, kill Sarah. Kill. Oh, he's dead. We, we should, we should We're walking dead man, but he, but he not in this condition. But we didn't kill him. No, uh, sorry, uh, it, it's a figure of speech. Ah. Yes, uh, as in he is dead, but he's just not yet. We did not kill him, though. No, but it's a certainty. He will be killed Okay. by us. He's not dead now? No. Walking dead man. Walking dead man. <laughs> walking dead man. I promise we'll fix your ear. Um, Matt. Hi. Just a quick thing. Can I have prepared lesser restoration in my... I... You've, you've had a long rest, so yeah. yes, yes, you... Yep. Okay, I... cool. I'm just gonna... I trust you guys to manage your spells without... Fine. Yeah. I'm just gonna get What's rid... more important? Ghosts in Rydlinthium? Or Sarah Cave Fury? Well, um, c- considering... Oh my god, or your cousin. Oh my god. Oh, it, stop no, saying that. Uh, <sighs> I, I, would, I would say that um, the, the, the Rylanthium um, spectres or, or, or whatever, um, maybe, maybe it's um, a way that Sarek is, is perverting the, the, the resource, um, the mineral, that therefore one would solve the other. Would it not? Or at least it's a, it's a start. How much of it is an innate property of Rylanthium, or how much is his own perversion of it? Um, that's its own question, which we will ask. Okay. Where did the ghosts come from? I have been thinking about that as well. I, I, I think we, we killed the people that were attacking us. We, you know, I, I watched you sever legs. Uh, D22 just sm- moustache goes up and he smiles quite proudly. I, 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 I put my sword through at least a few hearts and th- people died. Mm-hmm. I could control them because they died, but, but, but then they got back up. I, I, yeah. I think maybe there was s- some sort of infusion of the Rylinthium I- in them. Uh, I didn't... I don't... I didn't know that... I want to talk to my mama. (laughs) uh, How can we facilitate that? I don't know. Okay. But there is no one who knows more about Rylanthian than her. (sighs) How do you get in touch with her? I I, I don't. I haven't haven't since I left to find Sarek. But how would you? Well, I would send a message from a rad letter. Or... Yeah, send a courier, because we're all in the vow. It's not, doesn't take long to get in touch with people. Then, Maybe you should write a letter. Uh, well, yeah, if it's, 
perhaps we, we could find the nearest um, Vilrel embassy. Sure. I mean, they're, they're, they are a nation. There must be <laughs> one somewhere. Where do you find these? Uh, n- normally, uh, the, the more um, expansive cities would mm-hmm. have embassies. Maybe Upatop has one. Uh, y- s- certainly, um, if, it's, if it's big enough. Um, Does Cold even have one? Uh, I know we wouldn't go there. I'm well, just... yes, we're practically neighbours. That was why I was wondering if they'd bother. Can we show head to Upatop? Is that where Sarek is? Uh, well, I, I think it's the, the closest uh, settlement. Um, if nothing else, it would give us a chance to uh, uh, well, offload some of the many, many things we're carrying. And, well, I, I, I don't know. I, but we should rest for a time first. May we? I can try something on your ear, maybe? I don't know if it'll work. I've never really done it before. Okay. Uh, we, 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 we can give you some privacy. Um, sure. He actually turns his head around. <laughs> You're in a, a one room with a busted down wall and the cold snow blowing in. I like see will just sort of like grab by the upper arm goes, that means we step outside. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> um, Milo will like concentrate really hard and then I don't know if this will work what so are you going to do? Don't, it's it's a healing spell I think okay um, my little like put her hand out and put it on your shoulder um Ear come back, <laughs> and she's gonna cast lesser restoration. I thought she was gonna cast ear come back. Did you? Did you? Come here. <laughs> hey, there we go. Well done. Come here. Oh, no. <laughs> Do Wait. I reward this behaviour? <laughs> yes. Yeah. You get inspiration. Yeah. <laughs> Is that a reroll? Uh, yep. Yeah. You Wait. get a, you get one free reroll. Cool. Bad jokes will do you a world of good. Um. Quick question: Did you remove the bandage before doing this restoration or not? Just, just for the visual before I describe this. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 No, so, yeah. so the the boys step outside and you you come towards May away for a moment. You unwrap the bandage and it's still mangled. Sorry, and sorry, I'll put them back. I'll put, oh, I'll put them back. Stuck. It's stuck. You see, yeah. you see a more or less a stump where the air like blown clean off. The scarring and sort of small chunks and cuts all over it and it's it's still despite your your best efforts last night still been bleeding a lot but on the lesser restoration um you feel an energy come up travel up her shoulder and then small tiny blue icicles work up and surround the ear covering it and encasing with ice for a second and then slowly steaming away um you watch as the wound closes up and, and heals mm. and though the air doesn't grow back all the small cuts and everything solidify and turn into scars as if it's been healing for the last couple of months. Oh, and God, nice. your head pain subsides. You're able to sort of refocus your eyes a lot without this constant pressure on your head. And what remains is a long scar slightly protruding from where her ear used to be. Um, it hasn't come back. I'm afraid. Okay. Does it feel... Better? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Better. Okay. So much better. Okay. Um, Thank you. That's all right. Myla's voice, you can hear, but anything coming to the right is quite muffled, and mechanically, you have disadvantage on all ch- perception checks that rely on hearing until I say otherwise. Okay. Myla feels very self conscious of her own enormous ears. <laughs> if I do this... She's sort of like tucking them back if she can. And maybe like gonna pull her hair forward and try and hide her left ear under her hair. Because mm-hmm. I guess a, a filverelle with a missing ear is pretty hard to miss. <coughs> so can you... Does it look like my ear's just hidden under my hair? Yeah, I, I can't see them. I take down, like she takes down, because she has half up hair, so she just takes it all yeah. down. Does it look... You can't... Can you see the tip of my ear coming out? No, no, I think you're good. 
Um, okay. Myla again is just like, she's she's got really, really enormous ears. <laughs> like, stupidly large ears. And she's just like, uh... Don't worry. I, um... It's all right. Sorry. <laughs> Not your fault. I just wanted to... Oh, it's nothing there. I wanted to have something to remember home by. So... Okay. Would you like one of mine? No! Your, what? We put it in your other ear. Oh, you mean your ear end? Yes. No. <laughs> no, I'm okay. I don't think I can give you an ear. I thought that that's what you were offering for a split second. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm good. I have on this side, and you see there's like silver hoops on this side too. It's just... Okay. It was, it's all right. Okay. Um... Should we, should we call the other two in? Yeah, 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 just... What are D22 and Alexia up to while this is going on? Uh, the minute <clears throat> we get outside, uh, Alexia will just turn to D22 and just take a sort of breath of what looks like relief to go, thank you, sorry, I, I, I needed to... Um, needed to... No, be outside. Ah, how come? I feel I can have this conversation with you and you won't be um, perturbed by it because you don't have blood. Um, I don't... When when our friends bleed, mm-hmm. I can smell it. Oh. And I, it, 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 I find it deeply disturbing for some reason. I, 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 it smells I mean, bad? No. No, it smells really good. And I've been doing this for over a hundred years and I, I'm I'm kind of fine with it, but for some reason I now I, I don't like that I can smell them. Does that make sense? You don't like that you can smell them because Because I don't want my friends to smell like food. Ah. And you might choose to choose self preservation over that of your friends. Oh no I, I, I still have um a, a lot to drink. I just it, it 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 just feels wrong. And if you were to run out of blood, well would then you we've eat got your a, friends. Oh, I, I I don't think so. I'd have to be pretty desperate. Mm. Hopefully, we wouldn't reach that point though. There must be a point where each man or woman or thing is required to have to pick themselves or other people. Yes, I believe I, it's called every man for themselves. A bit of a sexist phrase, but yeah, yes, I I imagine. It is very dated. Yes. Um, hopefully not for us. If I've learned anything, it's we seem to be doing best when we're together. Like dead man walking. Well, uh, he's on his own, so he's fucked. I learn a lot from you, Alexei. You I, are a good teacher. I, I don't. I, I don't think I, I am. I, 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 I think I, we, we would learn from each other. Would you like me to teach you how to steal? Yes, actually, that would be quite useful. I imagine. Fantastic. Would you like me to teach you how to trade? Sure. Um. Yeah. yeah I, I. I don't think I'm very good with people. Um. You, you need to be able to talk to them to, to, to trade, and I, 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 don't, I, I don't like doing that. Yeah, but social skills are learned. This is what I was taught. Ah. Uh, they are not a skill that you are born with. They are something you pick up over time. You really should meet the rest of my family. They, 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 um, uh, they are... Yeah, socially inept. No, no, I'm, I'm the socially inept one. They're, they're offensively charismatic. Ah, you are the quiet one. Yes, yes. It strikes me that the world has far too many people talking and not enough people listening. There is still time. Hmm. Alexei, roll a d20 for me, please. No, killed! That's a natural one. Thank you. Bye-bye. If Joyra shows up right now, I'm sorry to God. As you are, carry on. (laughs) Straight in the prison. Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) Need to get you that little dance chair. Yeah, we do, yeah. How are you feeling? Good. I am feeling more aware of my presence. I don't understand. Uh, I am learning more and evolving as myself. Oh. Um, good, 
Good. Uh, it, it, is that... Well, you said that you've been uh, operational for three... Just uh, under four years. Uh, I, I, I'm Right, so your memories begin four years ago. Correct, yes. But Although some memories and instances can also be part of programming, I guess. But for me, my lifetime, as you would call it, started four years ago. Right. You really are growing up, then. Yes. Technically, I'm what a human would call a toddler. I, I, I did call you a baby at one point, yes. I remember. Mm. I think I'm quite advanced for a toddler. You are very advanced for a toddler. They are useless. <laughs> did you see me attack those people earlier? I did. Uh, do, you, do you mean with the hat or with the cannon? Because both were equally impressive. I am becoming rather proficient at attacks. You, you are, yes. Um, it really is. It, it, it's, very, it's very impressive. Mm. I was not designed as an attackive being. It feels powerful and rewarding and nice to wield this power. Well, power is quite intoxicating. Just um, I, I think the, the problem can be if people allow that, allow that to, to rule them. Mm. I mean, my, my, my family have ruled for hundreds, maybe even thousands of years. They have money and power. Probably the, one of the richest families in the world. Mm, they must be very happy. <laughs> That's at this point, Milo comes out to... Hey! Oh, oh, uh, hello. You can come back in now. Ah, oh, 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 okay. It's getting cold. Have you put the bolt on her ear? No, but I, I've stopped all the bleeding and things. I didn't manage to grow a new ear back, though. Um, but it, it feels better, apparently. Oh, uh, well, good. G- g- good. Oh, uh, well. Um, but yeah, come on, come on in. Um, yeah, I actually wanted to talk to you all about things like that. Um, Myla will wait until everyone's kind of in and be like, um... We go in. <laughs> Mary is just sitting on the floor, cross-legged, playing with D22's ear. <laughs> D22, what are you doing? Um, I've I've stepped back and put my hat off to let Alexi go through first. The door, so <laughs> Alexi would do the exact same thing, so I imagine we're both stand there for a second awkwardly. Yeah. <laughs> Rock paper scissors quickly. <laughs> <laughs> Happened again. <laughs> what? D twenty just pushes Alexi <laughs> firmly but kindly through the door before him. As you do that, you look down the road towards the town again, and you see those same two large figures by the gate. Make a perception check for me, please. Fourteen. The fourteen you make out. Two giants accepting a shipment. Too far away to make any sort of detail, but the sheer size, you see them standing about equivalent level with the walls. Can I... um... Well, you're about to have a meeting, so (laughs) it's up to you what you want to do now. I want to invest... I want to uh, move forward. I'm intrigued. I just want to move forward and see if I can make out exactly what these giants look like. He's doing a Mayway. Okay. You step away from the doorway, Milo, Alexi, you both see D22 stepping away. Oh, uh, no, no, it, come on. He just carries, he's not really, not, his eyes don't move, he's not listening. Okay. He just wants to go you, you walk a couple hundred feet down the road, make another perception check. <clears throat> Ooh, that's fresher. Uh, 15. With the 15, you're still a bit too far away to make up. You do see one of them heading back inside, pulling what looks like a large cart, while the other one seems to shake the hand of a something. You mm-hmm. are, like I said, quite a way away, but... They seem to be heading back inside the town. Mm-hmm. These are like dots on the horizon, really, at this point. There's no reason you can make out something so far away. Myla's gonna pop back out. D. I can see that. I can see their giants. You can see their giant sized. Yeah, I walk far. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna speed up, jog towards them. Okay. Uh, Myla will run after him and catch up. Hey, where are you going? Just walking. Walking. I'm not being rude, but I'm not. I'm off for all intents and purposes. Just, I'm just intrigued. The eyes, the eyes are like a ready green. Just focused. At this point it's disappeared and now you're just walking towards the town. Mm-hmm. And the road is starting to get a couple of carriages to go past. You I made it maybe three, four hundred yards. I don't see anything, I don't see anything nope. anymore. 
Okay. One. I hope. There. Hi. Sorry. Hi. Thought I saw dead man walking. Right. No dead man walking. It's fine. Okay. Back. Deception check disadvantage. <laughs> Ooh, disadvantage though. Yeah. Ooh, nine. Milo, that's up to you. I mean, I have an insight of plus eight. So. Yes. <laughs> you don't even need to roll if. You, like, I mean, I oh. did roll a natural one though. So. Oh. Um. Thought I thought, thought I saw something okay. important. Don't even need to roll, man. Disregard. I can't eat those words. Um. Oh, thank you. I think I think perhaps I need to rest. Oh, okay, yes, I think you I, you didn't sleep at all, did you? Resting would be good. Okay, um, yeah. If we need to fight him again, we need to all be. Come on, let's go inside. Maybe don't mention that to the others. I think they want to sleep a bit. Dead man rest. walking. Yeah. Why? Because dead I think... man walking is just an expression for someone who deserves to die and should and should already be dead despite looking alive. Yes, but don't mention if you think you saw him. Who? Sarek. I did not see Sarek. You just saw a random person that you think you should kill? Yes. Right, okay. <laughs> well, in that case, mention that all you like. Let's go back inside. Okay. <laughs> God, I'm gonna regret that later. You're teaching your toddler stuff. <laughs> um, cool. When they get back inside, Milo's kind of gonna like sit down and be like, where'd you go? Um, D thought he saw someone, thought but I he didn't. Did not. False alarm. Oh, okay. R um, right. Mayway holds out with his ear. Thanks. I don't think it fits me. Ah, wrong size. Yeah. No problem. <laughs> Thank you. Have any of you. <sighs> you know, I said that I've always been <coughs> able to do magic, like the throwing the spells and chatting to animals and stuff. Yeah. I was always able to do some things, but since I've been with all of you, I can do other things. Like when I tried to mend your ear, I've never tried to do that before. Huh. But, um. You're learning. Yeah, but I don't know where from. Books? No. No. People. Uh, but no one's shown me. I. D have any of you had that? Have any of you? I just wanted to ask. Um, well, uh, a, a, a little. Yeah, I'm getting. You know, the more I practice fighting, the more I fight, the better I get at it. Yeah, I have learned lots of lessons and morals and values from my friends. And some m m magic is innate. Uh, therefore, uh, it would stand to reason that the, the, the more you um, you practice it, the more proficient you become. Like muscle. The more you work out, the Precisely. stronger you get. I just... I used magic a lot when I was a kid. And it never got... I don't know. I wondered if there was something... Yeah, maybe it's silly. Oh, uh, well... Something um, what? No... It, I, I just wondered if it was something about being around all of you that specifically has meant that I can suddenly know n new things. And I was wondering if anyone else found that. Well, I work really hard to get, you know, better at the things I'm good at, so maybe it's brought on by need, you know? We need to survive. And we keep doing dangerous stuff, so you're learning, you're learning stuff to help us make it through these fights. Yeah. Before meeting you, I have been able to upgrade myself physically, whereas now I upgrade myself emotionally. <laughs> <laughs> and we are so proud of you, Dee. Yeah, you're doing really well. Um. Yeah. Okay. I just didn't. Um. I just thought I'd check, because I haven't... What do you think it is? I have no idea. Um, Are you I, worried? I, it seems like it's bothering y you. Well, it's like you just said, you work hard and things improve. I have never worked hard on this. 
it just happens. The, when you, uh, you use your magic, it is tiring, yes? Yeah, but... Yeah, that's what can hard at something. I've tired myself out doing magic for many years before this. Like... Yeah, but now you're doing new stuff. You were living in the battle doing the same thing. I was much the same. I was always, like, quite acrobatic and good, but it wasn't until I started, you know, broadening my horizons that I actually had to improve. Although, Mala might make a, a point. We, we have all um, been through a, a lot, not only um, sort of physical and, and emotional experiences, but also um, magical in the sense of... You went through a portal and nearly died. Well, we all went in a place where time didn't quite flow mm. as it should. Um, we've... We've done a lot. We've been subjected to a lot. And not to mention uh, the detonation of so much r rylinthium in close proximity to all of us may have had some unknown effect. It, it, is, um, it is a magical uh, mm. mineral, isn't it? It is. So... Uh, I just feel like I, I sometimes I wake up and it's just there. I have, it's like an idea. Suddenly I think, oh, I could do this. It's weird. It's something we can explore. Like, I had an idea. Um, if we meet Joyra again, I think I can make you look dead. Completely dead. What? Yeah. How? I don't know. But it's Magic. just there. That's and cool. I think no one would be able to know. That's awesome. Uh, no, not, not to... Um, uh, look at you, you're growing. If you were the type of person that accepted hugs, I would give you a hug right now. Oh yeah, please don't. This shack looks moving. like it could come down at literally any moment. Not even moving. But thanks. Not not to d d diminish the idea, but I, I rather hope we don't run into her again. Oh, agreed. I just thought I'd run it by you in case you thought it might be a good idea. We could pretend you're already dead and we're going to go bury you or something, or I don't know. Oh, y yes, but in all fairness, considering um, how uh, that, that whole exchange went, uh, I have a sneaking suspicion she, she will um, try and kill you. Well, all of you. Possibly. Yeah, that might happen. But I could then turn it back off again. Might buy us some time. Well, we'll think about it. I, I, I need to figure out how, how best to deal with her. It sounds like a really cool magical thing. Though. It does. I, I, do, I do not mean to diminish it. No, no, no. I Like I said, I don't, I don't really know if it's cool. It just popped into my head. When we were dead, yes. did you bring us back up to attack people? Um, well, uh, no. Um, because, well, uh... I'm just checking. I don't know if it happened and I didn't know. Uh, no, 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 um... Well, yeah, if you did, I didn't feel anything. Yeah, no, no. But so, um, to, to my uh, current understanding of it, um... I would not really be able to do very much with you because your your abilities are magical and require a lot more focus. Uh, whereas mine is, it's not a controlling of, of the mind; it's more a controlling of the body. Uh, so, um, so you can't use my ideas that pop into my head. Y y yes, that's right. Fair uh, whereas, and you were um, a, a little far out of my. Um, I, I can only I can only feel it happen within a certain um, proximity. Got it. Mm. Would you feel it with me? So, um, I, I do not wish to alarm you. Um, I can feel, I, I've been able to feel that the two of you, that there is blood pumping through your body. Uh, uh, right. Um, I couldn't with you. Now I can. What? What? There isn't, no, no, there, there isn't blood in him. But you can... 
Yes. Sort of sense that he's a thing? Um, if, if I if I wanted to, I think I could potentially try and um, control you. Wow. When he's alive? How long have you felt this feeling for? Um, which one of these am I answering once? <laughs> uh, um, he would need to be on the, um, it, it requires the mind to be um, inactive. All right. How long um, have you been able to feel this? Since, um, since, since the painted maze. Mm. You didn't drink any blood, did you, Dee? Not that I recall. All right, just I, I thought I checked. Why would drinking blood have anything to well, do with he it? He said he could feel blood inside him. Well, it's it's oh. no no it, it, it's it's a similar sort of sense, but I I know he doesn't have any. Looks inside his chest as yep. Yeah. Pile of gold. Mm. <laughs> yeah, just a couple of gold coins missing from the bag. Yeah, no. I, 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 I don't understand it. So you could control me the same way that I can control my. Yes. Mm. But again, the t- same problem I would have with uh, Myla. Uh, you're, you're mostly using your uh, magical energies, and I, I have no use of that. I'm sad you can't use me. I feel like you'd be able to really. Now, maybe you'd do better with me than I do. <laughs> Certainly not. I, I I doubt anyone could do better than you're or, already doing. And I don't want to um, control you without... Uh, you, you did give your consent, but... Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, 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 if we're ever fighting Sarek and I go down, you bring me right the fuck back up to hit him. Right, but you won't be you, and I have no idea how it would feel. I think I'm willing to put killing Sarah K. Fury above that for this moment. All right, I, I just I, I didn't I didn't want to assume, considering when I asked you for your consent, um, you thought I was human. I consent. Thank you. DM question: Just where is everyone standing at the moment? Oh no. Um. Just I mean. You've got like, a map here in front of probably you. just like in the middle. Of, I think we're all sort I'm of in the middle of the room. Let me get the old gaffers on. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Alexi is probably just off to the side of the door. So where's the entrance? Where so they like came just in this from, opening so? here. So oh, it's just it's, it's yeah, open. it's open. Yeah, it's very open. Yes. All right, yeah. Mayway's like cross-legged on the floor. So yeah, Milo'd be Maybe between this little D twenty-two and Alexi, I guess, because like we came Myla in. Right She's under there. Yeah, Myla there. Myla. Get it? Get it? Get it? As you were. Carry on. Great. This is great. That natural one is coming back very slowly. Yes. Dee, do you need to sleep? Uh, I need to sleep. Hey, rest would be uh, preferable for me. Do you want to rest more? Yes. (laughs) All right. Maybe you two should... Yeah. Uh, And she's, like, sitting on the floor, so she's kind of... Two twenty two his eyes just roll back and he's standing up but resting. Oh okay. cool. Cool. He... Mayway's head hits the floor. Cool. It's you can character and narrative stuff, you can rest, but mechanically you're gonna need to wait long before you can attempt to take another long rest. You can't just bang out eight hours, eight hours. <sighs> you, time does have to pass. Otherwise you can just like sleep yeah, no, off no, that and makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But um I'll go, oh but that's the question. Yes. Just rolling time back a little bit. Mm-hmm. Um mm-hmm. The Alexa took an eight hour long rest and um, I only need four hours for Correct. my long rest. So could I have tried twice or did I try twice and fail my con save? I feel like it was at the It end was of a wisdom episode. save because it's not the con, it's the right. basically the yeah. trauma that had, that had happened yeah. with that. Uh, you've only tried once because you only had one four hour long rest. And you've got to leave some more time I've before you can try it again. Small time. I'll give you okay, that time okay, now okay. so you know what you're working with. I'll dig that up for Understood. you now. Do I need four or eight hours? Or do I need you are eight, eight hours. Oh, four yeah. hours is, a, is an yeah, elf only, thing. Only yeah. elves. Damn it. You have to power down, buddy. Snow flood. <laughs> Standby mode. It's like the apple sound. <laughs> it is now set to turn do, off do, your Oh. Reese hands on. If Mayway is just going to kind of like on the floor. Mm. <laughs> Alexi's just going to get his coat and just put it on there. And you just hear from under the coat. Mm. Cool. R- rules is written as 24 hours. Like I'm okay. willing to be a bit lenient on that. I'm not going to be no, like, you fine. have to I wait can... until X, but yeah, you're going to have to wait a minute before okay. you can... Uh... In which case, from under the coat, in a couple of minutes, you hear... 
Slowly so going after Zarek. Um. She pops her head up. No. No. Not, not, not until you can stand unassisted. Please. <laughs> um, should we go keep watch? Uh, yeah, yes, well. Yeah, and Alexi is just gonna sit on the edge of the uh, opening. Oh. Yeah, might as well go sit with him. Cool. Guys, I can't just sit in this place for two days. Uh, no, but you can stay a little bit until we're uh, uh, moving at uh, full, full pace. All right, uh, perception checks, both of you, please. <laughs> and while you guys are staring outwards, Mayway does push ups. <laughs> oh my god, David! Uh, three. Another natural one. It's another natural one. Do How the turntables. It is nice to be back. Um, <laughs> you unbeknownst to you, things to you hear, I've seen I've rolled three natural 20s so far today, so it's going well. Well, what you don't see. Oh, great. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Kay Fury. 14 dragons just standing right outside it. <laughs> D22, I need you to tell me where you're standing when you're sleeping, please. <clears throat> We're never going to get to have watch. In the corner of the room. <laughs> Standing completely upright. I, I need you to be very specific. Oh, Jesus. Get that laser point under. You're in a derelict old building. So okay. I'm going literally in the corner there, collecting dust as I sleep, standing <laughs> completely upright. Cool, completely fine. And so Mayway's doing push ups like near D22's body then. Tell you what, Mayway, make a, uh, not a wisdom check, a perception check with disadvantage for me as well, please. Because you you're, not, you're not sleeping, you are oh, awake. Yeah. I'm yeah. not allowed to get more long resty, so. Yeah. It's all right. Disadvantage? Disadvantage. Um, no, it's fine. Oh, it's negative two, though. Nine. Cool. Never mind. Better uh, than us. <laughs> what you don't see is a just leaving a little bit of activity. You do see a few figures leaving the town. Way in the distance. You don't roll anywhere near high enough to see that. That's it. As you were. Carry on. Um... I feel like... Both of us have nearly died recently. Yes. Um. We never really got to talk about you trying to sacrifice yourself to keep us alive. All right. Um. Horrendously out of character, I, I assure you. Never quite happened before. Um, can it not happen again? I... No, it can't not happen again. I... I know what you were trying to do. I and I think it's lovely and really noble, but I think you were thinking it's better that we all live if just you die, right? Well, um yes. I don't think that is better. Why? Because, because when something horrible happens to someone that you're trying to protect and you, you're you fine, it, it's as if you died as well. So what's the point in living a life if you know that maybe you could have done something or maybe you could have helped your friend Well, um, I could have done something to help my friends, and I did. I meant me. What's the point in me living knowing that maybe I could have saved you? What sort of life is that? I, I, don't, I don't want to sound like I'm um, doing down your abilities, but... I don't think any of us could have done anything in that situation. We we were losing. We did, though. We got out. We all got out. Yes, 
but we got out because entirely unintentionally my surrender was a distraction and even then I we didn't quite get out there was a lot more difficulty and um, I took a flail to the chest which still hurts actually now I think about it um I just... <sighs> You're angry at me. Yeah. Okay. I, I don't want you to be angry at me, but I would rather you be angry at me and alive. I've lost people before and I don't want it to happen again so I'm very willing to put my life on the line for all of you and I will always do that I'd never I'd rather go down fighting with all of you than live to see the world without you all. I understand. And um, it, I trust it goes without saying um, I would die before I let anything happen to you. Um, it, but... His, I've I've come to see things a lot differently over the last few weeks, or depending on perspectives, months. Um, I'm not sure that one less cast out is such a bad thing. I mean, the Raven Queen certainly, certainly doesn't think differently to that. But I think, I think you're not the cast of that needs to not be around. Maybe that's just me talking um, because, you know, I like you and I don't want to see you die. But it sounds like what I've heard of your family. Total shits. Yeah. Yeah, honestly, it, it's, it's really, it's, it's just awful. Well... So, in that case, we need you around to do good. Yeah, 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 yes. Um, that that's a fair point. And I think we wouldn't be able to do anything about the cast abs without you. Not really. So I think you're more important than you think. Well, that makes sense. I don't think I'm particularly important. Well, you're very important to me. You are very important to me. Good. Good. Are you still angry at me? I, if you agree no more sacrificing yourself for what you perceive to be the greater good of keeping us alive, then I will put it away for now. No more sacrificing myself for what I perceive to be the greater good of keeping us alive. Yes. Okay. Okay. Um... I'm just gonna go. Are you okay out here by yourself for a sec? Are you okay? Yes. Someone else isn't. You're gonna go and talk to Mayway? Yeah. That's, yeah. I'll, I'll um, look at this lovely barren field. <laughs> um, shout if anything threatens your life in any way. Remember, no sacrifices. Thank you. Yes, I shall certainly yell if I see scary zealot women with javelins made of radiant light. Or, you know, an angry mob with kill Alexica death on signs or something. Oh, yes. Oh, it's fine. Most peasants can't read. Miley heads inside. 
You keep watch. Nothing really comes up, but the only thing I've noticed is just how quiet the road is. It's a large road, it's a wide road, it's a road that heads directly into the mountains off what you, being not an idiot, can assume is a major trade hub in the area. One of the only settlements you guys really come across, and your wanderings across the country. It's very quiet, and there is no traffic in either direction. There has not really been for some time now. Marla, as you were. Marla's gonna go over to Mayway, who she can presumably see doing push-ups with tears gently falling beneath her. <laughs> um, Mayway. When she stops, Mike sits up. Um, you know how Alexi and D twenty two are a little emotionally. Go on. <laughs> Stunted. <laughs> I was looking for a nicer word, but sure. Um, closed. Closed. Yeah. It feels like you're heading that way too. But from the opposite direction. You keep smiling and saying everything's fine and laughing about your bolts. But you are. That's very, very sweet gesture, can't deny it. It was very cute. And. <sighs> By the way, this space isn't that big. And that was an incredibly. A very lovely sentiment that you gave Alexi. Oh, yeah, no, he really is, needs to not be sacrificing himself for the good of the group, right? I mean, I'm a little bit on his side of those choices, but um, your sentiments are incredibly heartfelt, Myla. <sighs> Do I have to have the same conversation with you? It won't you... go the same way. <laughs> I just, I don't, I don't want to lose any of you. I don't want to die. Then, no sacrificing yourself for the good of the group or for a greater good cause. Well, I will make that choice when the it faces me. But I agree. I was on, I, you and I see eye to eye a bit more on the self-preservation side of things. Definitely. Alexi gave up way too quick. Like, I, I, <laughs> <laughs> I fucking appreciate it. I like obviously I'm very I'm straight up mad. So I'm happy to <laughs> if I die protecting you all, so be it. But yeah, I'm not going to oh, maybe I would do that as well. <laughs> from from the uh, the distance, you just hear ha <laughs> 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 Even due to his laugh, it's all the sleep. Interrupts the snore that you stand and leave Milo's just going to kind of shout back, it's different if it's me that gets to die. It's not. Hypocritical. <laughs> oh, it's so confusing having... <sighs> Mayway opens her arms. Teen to hug. We both know that'd be a very bad idea. Hey, you sometimes touch people. It's an offer of comfort. I can. T she reaches out and touches your hand. I can touch you. Mm -hmm. That's fine. Not really a problem. All right. So, hugs? No. No. Ever? No. With anyone? I've hugged people before. It, this, like I, I said, this is a relatively recent phenomenon. Right. It's not just hugs. Can I? You know, you're touching my hand. Can I give your hand a squeeze? I don't know. Can I try? <laughs> Alexi has the notebook. <laughs> <laughs> um. Uh, I, I, I would. Sorry. Um. Just uh, observing. Shh, Alexi, we're doing a science experiment. Yes. Um. Do we maybe maybe not do it in the place that's exactly. literally about to fall I, over? Yeah. Oh yeah. And actually, and if you if you go off, then Dee's also going to go flying. And so let's you're really this. tired. And I'm very tired, but I'm feeling healthy. Uh, oh. 
Minus we're, one is. We're trying to keep a low profile. Myla is starting to like sort of back away a bit. Okay. I Okay. okay. I don't know. <coughs> I just know I know in the gra- the guards grabbed me and that guy grabbed me and was on top of me. And when you hugged me, I know that sets it off. Um, I can also just do it if I want to, but I mean, I please no, no. Um, but yeah, I, it hasn't always been like that. I, you know, I, I like I said, I've, I've hugged people before. <laughs> okay, it, it's fairly recent. Well, are you interested in? Overcoming that, or learn to control it so that it doesn't just go off randomly. I mean, it hasn't really been a problem because no one's really wanted to hug me up until this point. And yeah, anyone who again. grabs me, I generally don't mind if I hurt them. Generally. All right. Well, if you ever decide that you want to start hugging people, I volunteer to be your. Uh, Experimental rodent. Surely that'd be Cyril. You want to maybe? You want to maybe blast Cyril across the room? Oh, I can hug Squ- Cyril. He's fine. Yes, I'm talking about experimenting with the, rodents. Um. So in the library, when you are testing out types of magic, you start on animals before you. Go off to we do what? It's a b- b- barbaric practice. <laughs> it's uh, not just the library, uh, as far as I understand. Alexi, is this just mm. a standard scientific practice? Um, uh, 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 f- yes, yeah, yeah, some humans do it too. It's why I don't like them. Yeah, that's why. All right. There you I go. didn't know we did that. It's not standard, but when people are developing new types of magic, you got to test it out somehow. No. No, we don't. I don't test it on animals. You... I don't test it on anyone. All right. Well, you're not creating new times of magic. <sighs> then where is all this coming from? I thought you guys liked experiments. That's the... Right? Isn't that what you do? Not, not with animals specifically, but you make experiments, right? You, you test out theories? Yeah, I, n- not like that. Maybe one day you won't have to. No, I... I think if... I think the only times we've experimented with something that wasn't just a kit or a book, Alexi and I have used each other. A living being? Yeah, but yeah, we ask each other, and it's fine. Honestly, I couldn't tell you. I know so little about it. Maybe they ask the animals. I don't know. I think they don't. Maybe. You never met anyone else like me in the library? Have I ever met anyone like Myler in the library? No. No. The only people that I really interacted with were other guards, which was kind of my role until I went up a slightly different vein, and really smart people who bossed me around. Yeah, I know the type. Sorry, carry on. Go, I just check your phone. You two, um, carry on. It's one of those episodes. Yeah. Um, okay. Maybe I'll... Are you okay? You're okay? I still kind of feel like I'm in shock. That makes sense. A lot happened yesterday, and I cannot help but take what he said to me to heart. I... I have been feeling like I am failing in my duties for a long time and it kind of got worse since I since Joyra attacked us that night 
and I lost any identifying sign of where I came from. But you still look like a snow elf. I do. So it's I pretty identifying. I don't look like I work for the Vale as a whisper, unless obviously someone recognized this and hold up the flail. Uh, yeah, I suppose. But also, he talked a lot of nonsense. He called me a puppy and a fae, neither of which well, is true. I mean, we kind of are. Yeah, but we're like, not. When elves are descended from the fae, oh my god, I know something. I feel so smart. Oh, no, wait, cover that up. Um, <laughs> yeah, but everyone knows that, but no one would call us one. Like, it's just, that would be weird, right? That'd be like calling you after your great 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 grandparents name and expecting you to answer to it um, isn't that why we have surnames <laughs> ah. okay but the puppy one that one is strange yeah that, that was odd strange. I think it's meant to be the leave one. the area <laughs> what I don't think D? he's ever done that before D D, and I touch D22 because we're still sitting quite close. Mm -hmm. D. D, I try to wake him up. D. Yes. Ha. I'm, I was resting. I'm sorry. Why did you wake me? You just said, you just told us to leave the area. Is everything okay? Processing. Ah, I was not telling you to leave the area. I have defense mechanisms that which when they feel something, they send alert signals. I draw Apologies. my sword. Yeah, okay, yeah. <laughs> yeah off I go. Shalele. <laughs> well. D22 goes back right. to sleep. No, D. Oh. oh. <laughs> you going back to sleep? Yeah. Cool, fine. Uh, you three make perception checks then, I guess. Uh, <laughs> may wait, disadvantage. Yep. <clears throat> Jesus Christ, David. I don't know what's wrong with me, Rose. <laughs> Do we not have guards? Do we not have guards? <laughs> 15. Right. Cool. Eight. Eight. Six. Six. You look around, you check the road, the road is just as quiet as it's been the entire time. You don't see anything focused on mining and tennis. You look around, the room appears pretty empty. It's fallen bits of wood, a couple of old crates. Nothing really to stand out. Can she like look through some, like look out, the, is there like a hole out the back or anything? Anything she just, just, back? just this, just this one gap, but yep. there's nothing, nothing else really. Okay. Um, Catching your attention. She's gonna walk out to where Alexi is standing there at the moment. Yeah, sure. And uh, look up in the sky. Mayway's gonna stay next to you oh. too. No, oh, oh, okay. that's my knee. Oh, no. oh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Sorry. What was your What was your question? Uh, she's just gonna look up at the sky. The sky's clear. A couple of birds. Mm. This I is. I summon my echo. Okay. Uh -huh. Who appears next to D22, and Mayway will walk away. I'm going to send Cyril up on the roof. Cyril pops up. Can I have Cyril, please? You can have Cyril. Hi, look, there's a ceremony. Please do not it's break my ceiling. A please. truly ginormous. Oh. It's a very flimsy. Look at him. Look Yo, at that you enormous. Good boy. <laughs> Despite looking, you don't see any immediate threat in D22 as snores echo against the snowy sky. I, I, I swear, if that oh. was a prank. Oh, and I say. I mean, no one could be invisible, right? Right? Well, now you've said it, someone absolutely is. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, wait, haven't people, like, watched you before or, like, talked oh, in your no. head? Yeah, but that's not happening right now. <sighs> oh, God. If oh, someone is watching, would you do, please just, just, just show? We've had a very long few days... Maybe we flips off the air. <laughs> um, right, well, either there's no one there or they're rude. Myla. He was, maybe he was just joking. I think it's, I think it's fairy fire. Yes. Myla's going to cast fairy fire. Does that need a target? Um, no. No, AoE and outlines oh. anyone invisible in the light of her choice of colour. Yep, yep. What's the uh, save that needs to be made? Dex, 16. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> uh, natural 16. Your fairy fire fails. You don't see anything. Oh, there's nothing. Okay. 
Um, it's still up, by the way. It's now just it's up. There's a little cool. cube of it around. What colour did you pick? Uh, oh, I get to pick a colour. Obviously, green, blue. purple, or blue. Blue, obviously, it's always blue. There's like a blue shimmer that sort of like sways a little bit in the wind and the snow, but nothing seems to appear. I mean, he is a bit of a prankster, I guess. <sighs> this is gonna take some getting used to. Yeah, I guess there's. I guess there's. I don't know. Maybe it. Maybe he heard it and it's gone into the loop. Maybe he was having a dream. Maybe. Alexi. Yes. D twenty two might be dreaming. Get your notebook out. <laughs> <laughs> I really think I should I should keep keep the sword in hand and, uh, until we're we're absolutely certain. Are we, are we absolutely certain? I mean, we can't ban anything, so I none of you have any reason to believe there's a threat. Myla is going to. If, if you're both up, I'm gonna. How how long have we been awake for, DM? Ninety minutes, maybe. Oh, where's my long rest? Ninety um, minutes. Is that all right? Oh, Jesus! You've, you've had a conversation you up, and some so breakfast. It's not been long. Your long rest, Milo's going to go sit on the edge, kind of dangling her feet off like a bit plank of wood or something, and she's going to start reading her book. And you sit, and we'll expedite this a little bit. Conversations ahead. The unease you just felt melts away. Mayway just watches her echo. She doesn't dismiss her. She just watches it. Dance around D twenty two. Echoes of last night, still playing your head. Mm-hmm. But for now, we're gonna take a break. What the fuck was that, man? <laughs> roll better. <laughs> Shut up. You roll worse. <laughs> yeah. No. I cast fairy fire. <laughs> no. Cool. Greetings, peasants. Alexi Karstav here. I uh, hope you're enjoying watching me in the show. I'm doing a fantastic time this week. No, uh, we wanted to thank the people who all make the show so great. Oh, God's sake. Uh, yes, 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 there is, uh, there is Erin Gray, who did a truly beautiful rendition of My Lovely Face. And everyone else. Uh, and, and them. Uh, there is Michael G- Gelf- Gelfi. I do this every time. <laughs> Gelfie. Gelfie, yes, he does the uh, the very heroic music that you see me being very handsome in. Finally, uh, who else do we have? We've got... There's Sticky Fingers, who does all the amazing maps that we get to fight on, or sometimes not fight on and immediately leave. Um, there's Loki Fellows, who also does amazing episode art, and she does all the show animations, which is, like, super, super talented. We also have that uh, the, the social media sorceress, uh, Tanya Garamani. What is it with people and titles, honestly? It's so gauche. And uh, we also have Jeffa and Nate doing their uh, technical wizardry behind the scenes. There are links for absolutely everyone in the description, so you should go check them out because they're all awesome and really so much more talented than we are. Uh, I mean, than you. Welcome back. David's very happy to see he's waving just off there. Uh, before the break, the our party had some very needed conversations, I think is the best way to, to put that. As the party rests and D22 comes towards the end of his long rest cycle, it's been largely uneventful, save for something triggering D22 during his rest. But upon examination, nothing really appears to have been seen or, or happened and. After checking thoroughly, the uh, team eases in for the rest of the day, talking, 
swapping stories and ideas back and forth as they begin to plan the next step of their journey. And as the day carries on and your long rest begins to cycle over, D22, you slowly or quickly awake. Up to you. Mm -hmm. What happens next? Good morning. It's about four mm -hmm. o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Ah. That was a nice rest. Oh. I am feeling powerful again. Uh, do, do, do you um? You talk in your sleep. That. Do I talk in my sleep? Yes. You you mm. sa you said um, uh, <laughs> something about an, an intruder or or an alarm or. Ah, allow me to oh. check my memory logs for the evening. His head just roll back in his eyes. Funny you went your <laughs> sent your eyes cross-eyed yeah. then. Yeah. Just <laughs> <laughs> yes, approximately 6.5 hours ago, my left leg was touched by something I could not see or hear, but I felt it. Well, oh. that's deeply disturbing. But that might have been me when I tried to wake you up. Uh, no, I tried to, I touched you after you said that. What? Word. Okay. It was like a rare. It was a rare. This is all the information that I have from my memory logs. It was probably a rare. But I you guess. used a spell and. It doesn't always detect everything. Which leg? Left leg. Can I take a look at your left leg? I will also examine the left leg. Sure, sure. make a. <clears throat> it's not medicine. Investigation? Can you pick it up and take it off his body and hand it over? Yes, out? yep, that's so ah. much better. Thank uh, you, oh, please do oh, that. Okay. <laughs> Myla um, is giggling to herself about this. <laughs> All right, I'm going to channel my mother. Arcana investigation check. Oh, I am good at both of those. I am good at neither of those. Um, I am going to go for oh. investigation now. I get a plus one for investigation too. Disadvantage, please, Rose. Why? Because you're exhausted. Really? I thought ability checks... Yes, ability checks is the first, first one. First one, fuck. Yeah. 13. Cool. Ooh, can I? Uh, 11. Uh, on an 11, you both you both notice this, sorry. D uh, all three of you just like hiding around as D20 just standing there on one leg. Um, <laughs> Myla's just gonna reach over and kind of prod Alexi and give him guidance. D4? Uh, add, a, add a D4, yeah. 14. <laughs> sure. Um, you both you both sort of examine it, and like the leg feels fine. There's no like hair or anything in there. You do feel like there's a bit of like white sort of like kind of saliva, a little bit on where the ankle would be, but beyond that, the leg seems normal. Like something's licked it. <laughs> I. Uh, I don't find anything. I think. You know, you both with that. You oh, both. You both right. find that. Ew. Ah. Ugh. Uh, uh. Does it smell of anything? Or it smells like saliva, they bad breath. Like uh, no, 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 ter ter terribly unhygienic. Um, hmm. So. So it, it appears that, uh, like a, that something uh, tasted you. Like a badger. Interesting. This is your analysis from what you have found on my leg. How high up the leg? Ankle. Ankle. Right, okay. Something small gave you a. Mmm. Perhaps, yes. Um, one Milo one is you going do this to, during, while this is happening, resting? sit down in the middle of the room mm -hmm. and no. start ritual casting the tech magic. Okay. Uh, do you want to give Dee's leg back now? Oh, right. Um, finished? Yes, yes. Uh, uh, do you need a... Uh, 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 oh, right. Well, that, 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 that's fascinating. <clears throat> sure. So you sit and you focus for a moment. Um, for ten minutes. Ten minutes. <laughs> for, for several moments. Um, and as... And the energy sort of pulses out. You do detect some transmutation magic coming from a couple of the crates in the corner. Mm. I draw my sword. Myla's not going to say anything. She hasn't said anything. She hasn't said anything. I'll pick your sword away. Milo, like looks over at the crates and then gets up and walks over. Sure. And opens them. Roll on a shift. It's a fucking mimic, isn't it? The moment you place your hand on it, oh. it spills open and a long blue tongue spills Ooh, out. Cool. Whoa! For fuck's sake. Uh, I also need. Oh, oh no, the shack's falling down. It's fine. Um, oh, yeah, I mean, so half everybody? Uh, yeah, yeah, we're, we're absolutely in uh, combat. Initiative is an ability check, isn't it? Uh, yes. Yeah, so I roll with disadvantage. Heat. I rolled a natural one on my attack roll. Of course I did, wouldn't it? Matters. <laughs> right, let's. 
Mimicry. Let's do something better than that. Right. Right. So it immediately snaps. You jump back, anticipating something not being quite right there, uh, and miss completely. Cool. So we're going for initiative then. In that case, uh, cool. Uh, Twenty-five to twenty. Twenty to fifteen. 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 Fifteen to ten. Twelve. Twelve. Uh, yep. Sorry, I'm eleven. Eleven? Yeah. Myla? Nine. Nine? Cool. Nine. I'm so bad at initiative rolls. <laughs> Alexi, at the very, very top, take it away. I draw my sword. You draw your sword. <laughs> uh, Alexi is going to sort of put his hand at the top of ah, the... This is dismissed, by the way. Okay. How long does it last? It's been eight hours. It, it doesn't... It doesn't? it doesn't have a timer. Oh, okay, in which case, fine. Still chilling. Uh, D22, you are where you were. Mm-hmm. Cool. Uh, yes, sorry, Alexi. Alexi's going to position his hand uh, just towards the top of the hilt. Yep. Uh, and top of the scabbard, sorry. And as he pulls it, um, we'll rake it across his palm. Mm-hmm. Uh, so instead of it just like appearing, it's essentially like he's drawing this sword made entirely of white flame. Uh, I will take, because these are a d6 now, four points of damage. Oi, oi. <clears throat> um, the DM gets a text. <laughs> and Alexi is going to run at the mimic that uh, went for Myla and attack it. Sure, make an attack roll, please. I make two attack rolls. Good for you. Good Ooh, for you. You yeah. get a second attack now? Yeah. Alpha, oh, God's Level sake. five is a big... Everyone's level five now, by the way. Um, you should watch the post-show check, because that's where we do those things. 14 and a 22. Both hit. Sweet. Also, oh, you, yeah. sorry, a 22? Don't you mean a dirty 22? Dirty 22. There we go. Sorry. Come on. Sorry, I was... I was Distracted by the fact that the seven looks a lot like the one. It does, it does. That was a split second of... Right. Oh, sir. Wait, yes. Yeah, yeah, that's right, yeah. Okay, do you want the damage separate or...? Uh, No, go for it. Okay, cool. So that is 10, 16, uh, wait, 16, 22, 28 points of damage. 22, did you say? 28. 28, sorry. What? How? Um, D6 is for the short sword, uh-huh. and D- my thing is now D6 for my um, oh, right. right. Yeah. Right, lovely stuff. Cool. Mayway. Um, uh, yeah, I'll notice that that is happening, and I guess I'll just step forward and lift up my arm that has my little buckler on it, yep. and swing my flail round so the chain catches on the buckler and smacks the... Go for it. Make, make an attack roll, nice. please. Nice. Not with disadvantage yet with my attacks. Woo! Thank fuck for that. Uh, whop. Ha! Ah. Um, nine? Nine? Nine misses, sorry. Uh, uh, over the top. <laughs> and comes back, and then I just, ah, fucking, never use the shield anyway, and throw it down, just <laughs> whack second attack. Cool, great stuff. Ha! Natural 20! Natural 20, there we go. Fuck the shield. Roll away. <laughs> <laughs> Have you fucking dropped the shield? No, no, it's just it's strapped to my arm and I can use it to. Good to know, give it good to know. That play or not. Um, Dam Arj, come here, darling. Doodly do. Ooh. Nice. Um, oh, God, now I have to do numbers. Uh, do I double my pluses as well or do I. No, I no, no. Double the dice. dice plus the modifier. Okay, cool. So then that would be 14, uh, 20 points of damage. Slashing. 20? 20. Cool. Two Thank zero. You. Already looking very, very hurt. Uh, the Mimic is regretting its decision immediately. D22. <laughs> um, D22 is going to get his trusty crossbow wielding arm out, cool. upturn it, and he is going to shoot a firebolt. Great. Uh, into the side of Make it. an attack roll for me, please. <clears throat> Oh, it's not good. It is a 13. 13 just hits. Oh, amazing. Okay. Nice. And I get two D10s, I'm get so it's going to hurt. No, there's more than one. Is that? Okay. Really? Yeah, you said a couple wow. of Wow. Oh, it's 12. Oh, it's 12. Yeah. It's 12? Yeah. 12 points of damage? One yep. of them could just be a cray. You don't know. No, they pinged on my magic. Cool. It's going to be a cray with magic shit, isn't it? Yeah. And there's my bonus. If you're oh still God. going? It's not. You've had a long the rest. Whole shack. No, if he's still going. Oh, uh, oh, right. Okay. Gotcha. No. It's possible. 
my bonus is to do nothing. <laughs> All right. Ah. Myla. Yay! I rolled a, a terrible initiative roll. Wow, bonus less than Myla? Sh- yeah, I know, right? Jeez. Um, bonus action, sh- the, like, big shards of ice are going to come up over the... Shalala! Shalala! And then Sorry. I'm going <laughs> to hold my hand out and a puff of noxious gas is going to come out of it. Uh, that is a con what, save. What type of damage is this? Smelly. It's the skull one. Poison. Okay. Uh, cool. Con save, DC 16. DC 16. Taste the difference, boo. <laughs> yeah. uh, it's a natural eight, so it fails. Cool. 2d12 damage. Damage. Do 2d12 damage? 2d12 damage. Okay, um, fuck you. Eight plus seven is fifteen points of damage. It goes up from one d twelve to two d twelve at fifth level. What happens next? Yes. Nice. Um, initiative. So yeah, Myla like gets the staff out and then just immediately like sends this this gas out as the <coughs> gas kind of heads inside the mimic's giant slathering mouth and then just goes like, <coughs> and, and then begin- just kind of like goes. <coughs> Begins to sort of shrivel and rot <laughs> and turn black, and his eyes sink inside itself. It's sort of like snaps and melts away. Right. Boxes in a box. <laughs> it did with their two pings. Any other boxes? Top well, of wait. initiative, Alexi. It's yeah. your turn. Any other boxes? Which one's pinged? Uh, which ones did ping? Uh, when I did detect magic, it was there that. are two in that direction. Is your detect magic still running at the moment? No, but I would have got the the. I'd have known which ones popped up, right? Yes. Uh, Matt being like, I don't want to tell them. There's one that pinged as a box. There's another one which is pinging, but not a box. What is it? The wood's pinging a little bit. The whole fucking place is a mimic, I tell you. I'm not that mean. Aww. Um, that <laughs> box, but also this bit of wood? I stabbed the shit out of the bit of wood. <laughs> Fire! Fire! Which one? I need you to be more specific than that. The bit, the bit of wood, wood that Myla's pointing box. at. Not the box. <laughs> so, I see in front of me three bits of wood. Which bit of wood is Myla pointing at? Uh, Matt, which bit of wood is Myla pointing at? So it doesn't give you specifics, it points a direction, so... Like, roughly the... Which, you need to choose one of these three. Okay. Um, well no, Myla would just be like, it's somewhere over there? In the wood? Two attacks. Something <coughs> in the woodshed. Well, I mean, yeah, two attacks will um, will really figure this shit out. Okay, okay, cool. I will run over to the wood. Yep. Uh, first attack on left bit of wood. Okay. Uh, this. I'm gonna roll. Cocker here. <laughs> okay. Which which one? Sorry. Uh, you, come on. There we go. This cocker. This one. Yeah. <laughs> you run up and stab. Yep. Nothing happens. Great. Next one down the line, this prick. Cool. As soon as you approach, it had a held action ready. Of course uh, it did. Yep. Are you fucking joking me? <laughs> yeah. Three and a six, you piece oh, of oh, shit. Oh, found, found it. <laughs> Fine. As you get close, suddenly it stands up. Oh my god, I, what? I don't have a mini for this, I'm very, very sorry. But a mouth, some, a gate, as it stands, I sort of. I sort of. Looking down at you. Uh, goes to chomp. Misses completely. Uh, you can still make an attack roll since it's yeah, your As it goes down to chomp, Alexi just um, darts off to the side and is going to stab the short sword into it. Okay, cool, make an attack roll for me, please. Uh, 17. 17. 17 hits. Um, seven plus six, 13 points of damage. 13 points of damage? Cool, good stuff. Cool. All right. Uh, Maywe, you're up. Um, with my bonus action, I'm going to move my echo over to the other side of the piece of wood that Lex is currently fighting. Yep, good stuff. And then I will step forward and smack it with my flail. Yep, not yep. a problem, that's all good with me. Go for it, make an attack roll, please. Uh, da, 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 18. 18 the hits. First one. Da, 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 da. Ooh, seven again! Nice. Uh, 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 13. Let's, let's put you in melee range of both me and Jurako, hasn't it? Uh, yeah. 
Genius. <laughs> 13. Okay, uh, yep. Because he gets flanking now. 13. 13? Yeah, points of damage. Oh, oh points of damage. damage. Uh, yes. And then second attack. Pa, pa, pa. I rolled a four, but I'm going to use my inspiration. 11, uh, 17 total. 17 hits. Cool. Nope, that's a d10. <coughs> uh, 10. 10? Points of damage. Cool. Great. Anything else you'd like to do? Um, bonus action, movement, attacks. I'm good. Yeah. yeah yep, I'm good, good, good. All right. Seeing a legs, you can take one chunk and then you sort of come in whack, whack. It sticks its long blue tongue out and it's going to slam attack you there. Uh, Me? Myla. Yes, you. Uh, but I'm no, 10 sorry, feet away. No, I'm, I'm, I'm lying. So... You know what? That's a good point. That's going to go for you instead of Lexi. 16. Misses. Fuck sakes. Sentinel. <laughs> <laughs> I can hear. I can hear next door. Yeah, thank you. Great. I can hear next door. Uh, wait, so that's from the echo perspective. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Uh, da, 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 that's going to hit. It's uh, 14. 15. 14. Oh, sorry. 14, yep. 14 just hits. hits. <coughs> and. Come on, Dylan. Uh, eight points damage. Eight, eight points. Damage is damage. Yep. And it can't move. Cool. Uh, right. D22. Do. I, if, if I'm going to do my Eldritch Cannon, do I use an action? Can I not do it whilst we're in combat? You can, but it's an action to summon it. Okay. In which case, I'm going to do it because I'm going to want to use it for a long time. So um, I am going to go for flamethrower this time. Okay. Um, flamethrower. Eldritch cannon is now on my shoulder, so I'm going to conjure that, please. Yep. Um, and then, er, as you want to move, or are you you happy? Can I go right into the corner? Which which corner? Sorry. Yeah, uh, the corner back there. This one? Um, the, the other corner. Deeper into the corner nope. was it? Laser printer. Nope. La- la- you know, laser. Yeah, fucking not printer. Ah, pointer! I thought you laser printer. I was like, cool, cool. I did right, say right into the corner. Yep. Yeah, yeah, right into the corner. Can I, can I investigate the box there in the, in the corner? Looking oh, is that the little box? Yeah. Mm. Wait, was it? You're talking about what this no, was? Yeah. No, no, just the, the, there's a crate itself oh, underneath there. Oh, uh, in there. Just, that was just decoration, like, not okay. necessarily at all, but yeah. No problem. Yeah. So, you don't have to use it as a. You can do something else. That's all good. Um. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm gonna okay. Wait. Yeah, yeah. Cool, cool. Good stuff. Uh, Myla. Um, Myla is going to hit it with Shalele. Great. Make an attack roll, please. Will do. Let's roll this one. Let's see how this one does. Oh yes, that's an 18 to hit. 18 absolutely hits. Do you need you... to get in um, melee with it for that? Oh yeah, sorry, can you move? Yeah, oh, of course. <coughs> yeah. Would you want to come around? Uh, yeah, sure, why not? Let's be up there. We're just mobbing it. You really point. are. Um, and then it's... We were having a conversation! <laughs> oh, you good. Um, <laughs> you good. You good. Five plus seven. Twelve. Twelve, thank you. Um, Twelve points of damage, cool. Shillelagh. And then, for shits and giggles, oh dear. Myla is going to bonus action hide under her cloak. <laughs> Uh, sure thing. Make a stealth check for me, please. Myla becomes a box. <laughs> Myla gets solid. How good um, a box are you, Myla? Eleven. Eleven? All right. Good to know. The mimic uh, thinks you are its child. Top of initiative. Alexi. Um, I've just seen Myla walk in, crack this thing with a staff, and now she's pretending she's a box. <laughs> We're just going... Um, Alexi. She's still a little like. Yeah. <laughs> Alexi, somewhat thrown by this, will dance, just is. stop stabbing at this thing. <laughs> All right, make your attack roll. Can it? It's our version of Boris dancing. Natural 20 oh! and a 15. Both hit. Yes! <laughs> I mean, go on. <laughs> Copper is the thing. Yes. Okay. Great. So that is 
12, 15, 20, 26, 32, 38 <laughs> points of damage. <laughs> Christ. It had 19 hit points left. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell us how you just shatter this giant plank of wood as it bears down on you. Okay. I felt it had a single fucking one. Right. As it <laughs> as it bears down, Alexi will kind of um, dart off to the side again. Grab his hand as this thing lifts its head back up, so he kind of flies up with it and is standing on the top of the box and is just going. <laughs> <laughs> And just cutting down this yep. mimic. It's <laughs> screaming a little bit and just slowly <laughs> falls off half yeah. the eyes, go inside its head. Jump off, do a roll, turn around and go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Thank you, I, I, I did think that looked rather good. <laughs> do I make a convincing box? Uh, an, uh, oh. Not with an 11, no. I, 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 yeah, you do, man. I, I have no idea who's talking. It's me. <laughs> the box. Make it a <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he's humoring her. Natural 20. <laughs> 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 Alexi says it without stammering. Oh. Like, I have no idea who's making that noise. <laughs> Where's Milo gone? <laughs> I, I don't know. Anyway, I'm so concerned. I don't. I shall send out a search party immediately. Oh my. The very bad box um. begins giggling. <laughs> I swear, I don't, I don't know what's going on. Right, I'm going to go and find Dee, Myla. where's Myla? I'm here! Oh, there she is! Oh, Myla, you scared me. I, I was a box. She was pretending to be a box. Thank you, Dee. Oh, I, you saw it. Uh, your, your perception must be uncanny. My perception is very high. Um, right. Right, well. So, um... Let's check if there's more, I guess. Uh, there was one another thing that pinged, wasn't Was there one? No, was you're, there? No, you're in the clear. Are you alright, buddy? <laughs> that, that was, um, that He's, was all of them. What a He's waste passed. of a mimic. What a waste of a good mimic. Two good mimics. Yeah, yeah. well, apparently not. I can't fucking hit anything. <laughs> <laughs> um, Milo's just gonna be like, that, that's all that popped up. Ah, thing. Okay, right. great. Um, alright. I, I'm I'm just going to and Alexis is going to just start like kicking the bodies off their little bit of uh, temporary base. Ah, mm. Now that like uh, the magic's gone, like the hardwood is now just like soft gelatinous flesh. Ugh. A few like small like half digested bones to, like spill out from travelers that weren't quite as lucky as you that have spent refuge here. <laughs> He's just like using his sword. Mayway is gonna dismiss the echo and like kind of kick through the guts to see if anything interesting is inside these things. Sure, as you as you sort of kick through, you do find a small red velvet pouch covered in gunk, but tied hey. and sealed. And not being particularly squeamish, she picks up, ugh, ugh. Mm -hmm. looks inside. Inside you find this very fine, deep navy blue powder. Like. Dusty. You rub it on your fingers, it falls through. It's sort of consistency of like flour or sand. Like sort of a mix between the two. Does my smell like anything? Go. <laughs> oh my god, what people are grinding up my lithium and smashing <laughs> it. Uh, Does it smell like anything? It it smells slightly nostalgic. There's almost like a, a petrichor smell to that. There's like a soft sort of scent. And as exactly you sort of like sniff it a little bit, you, you feel at peace. You feel hopeful with that sort of like soft scent. Guys, what? I found this. Smell? What is it? I don't know. Smell? Smell. No? Do I also get the same thing? You do. Do I? That's similar sort, of, similar sort of scent. That's quite nice. What is it? I don't know. Hmm. It's do you want, blue powder. Do you want us to have a look at it? To try and figure out what it is? Or oh. you can keep it. Well, you can give it back to me after you have a look at it. Sure. I throw it to you. Alexa, do you know yet what that ring does that you put on? Oh, um, no, not a clue. Right. Do we have a way of figuring that out? I would have enough time out? to attune to an identified ring, wouldn't I? Was this the ring you got from Club Gun? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Um, bear with me one second. I might know, on. actually. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. Let I, me think I, about I it. Give me, give me two seconds. Give me Let me think. Because Is I, I, anyone I, I, able to identify things here? Alexi, do I have your ring still? 
Uh, from when you, get, you, when you gave me your ring? So, no, 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 the, no, my lab the ruby was used to um, Give you restart life. you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Myla has, has the signet ring. Yeah. But you have <coughs> a signet ring because we had a bunch in the yeah. sacks. We had four one, empty so signet have, rings. You have yeah. your own signet ring. Beautiful, <laughs> yeah. beautiful. Good to know. Are you, are you going to turn it into a thing? <laughs> are you going to make like a really he's cheap imitation of Alexi? He's got a, he's, he's <laughs> working up a spells with it. Working up a cosplay. Of course he is. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, so you look at the ring, it's a brass ring, um, and there are simple slits in the middle, sort of filled with jade that catch the light quite nicely. Um, you feel stronger, this is a brawler's ring. It doesn't require attunement, um, but what it does do is your unarmed strikes deal bludgeoning damage equal to 1d4 plus your strength, rather than just the straight strength roll. Um, <laughs> it's made me good at fist fighting, I, I feel. No! <laughs> I, I, I don't know. I, you, you hear a voice in your head, you should test it. <laughs> That's, this is very much Matt saying really? this. Really? Punch me. Uh, are, are you sure? Go on, go on. Uh, 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 okay. Uh, uh, sorry. Alexi will just. See, ex- experimenting <laughs> on living creatures. He's going to stand really unsure for a second and just very casually. <laughs> cool. Roll a d4 on your strength? Ah, roll to hit. Oh, yeah, roll to hit, roll to hit. All right. Uh, yeah, hit. 16. Hits. 16 hits, roll damage, 1d4 plus strength. Two. Plus strength? I don't have any strength. <laughs> just. <gasps> Nice. Uh, uh, oh, 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 all right. You're... No, no. Oh. <laughs> um, you're a strange woman. I'm, I'm, I'm very fond of you, but you are a strange woman. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, right. Uh, so where were we? Oh man, I'm just gonna take. We my should HP try and figure down. out what this blue powder is. But also, we've got those other potions too. We should uh, try and figure out what they do. Yes. Do, right. I, do you guys have any way of magically identifying this stuff? No. No. Oh. Anything? Well, I maybe do, but I need to check. <laughs> um, impromptu science club. I could do let's, let's do check. that. Let's okay. go over to like a corner and both be like. <laughs> right. Um, you made a potion. You should join yeah. science club. I did. Science club yes. is for nerds. <laughs> um, Damn right. You, 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 let, oh, yeah, okay. we're the cool we'll, we'll, kids. We'll, 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 we'll test that. We've tried tested that. That was the frosty breath one. Oh yes, so it was. Okay, right. This one makes me angry to hold. Oh, let's me test that one. <laughs> oh, 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 no. <laughs> oh. Science Lexi? club. We've yes. like taken ourselves off to a, like a corner. And <laughs> oh god, they're doing their thing. We're not allowed to hang out. Every so often, there's just a <laughs> and then just glance. Then, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm not gonna let you guys have my little bag of powder if you're not gonna exclude me and D from this. Process. Okay. Oh. The big powder gets thrown back. Cool. <laughs> D, will you tell me what this is? Mm-hmm. Notebook. Just, just a small note from the DM. Your bags are very full. Yeah. yeah. So obviously the small pack of dust you can do, but just, just bear <coughs> in mind, you're not a lot you guys can carry. So cool. can what potions a... were there? There was the pink, the one that makes you angry. It's red skull-shaped potion that makes you angry to hold. Myla will test a little bit of the red skull-shaped potion that makes him angry to hold. Okay. okay. It makes everyone angry makes to hold. Makes everyone angry to hold. Yeah. Okay. Like you hold it and you're like, oh yeah, Ooh. I'm also Ooh. mad. Yeah. One moment, please call her. Uh, just going to tell you the other ones while Matt's doing that. Yep. We also have the yellow pink potion, which are two words I never thought would go together. Cloudy green. We got two of those bad boys, and an orange smoky potion. We'll test all of them. Mm. <laughs> so, just describe to me how you taste this skull shaped. Um, Milo's going to like open the top. Immediately, a scent hits you of rotten raisins, and you know, like when you touch like old coat hangers or like sort of like iron that's been sitting out for too long just mm. a waft of it just sort of smacks you but also like you feel made you anger to hold even just looking at it and like feeling the scent just you start to feel like this sort of anger boil up inside you i am extremely angry that this smells this bad <laughs> i liked it interesting um while gonna like take the the stopper basically yeah and like just her tongue to the the stopper at the top so that she just gets the teeny tiny The teeny bit. The moment it touches it, you feel this rage boil up inside you and you let out a mighty scream. Well, that happened. And for like a split <laughs> second, you are under the effect of the rage attribute. She puts the stuff back in. Mala? Hang on. Uh, I need you to make a wisdom saving throw, please. No, it, I assume this isn't a charmed one. Um, no, it is not. Yeah, fine. 
Actually, no, we're going to use that one. It... Mayway does jump like a foot in the yeah. air with that. It's a proper blood curdling battle cry. Yeah. Uh, wisdom save. Yes. 11. I mean, I don't. So. I might just be. Immediately, it leaves your system like the small amount doesn't affect you. The blood comes away like bloodshot eyes, um, but you do take one point of psychic damage. Ooh. Ow! Oh! Just saying, guys, I feel like the two things we've identified so far should go to Mayway. <laughs> Um, Rage potion, yeah. ring of punching. Yeah, it, um, sorry about the screaming. <laughs> oh. I like to see why I have to spit from his face. Yeah, sorry. Um, it, 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 it's quite all right. I felt very, um. Angry. Very <laughs> angry. We knew that. But in a really, like, powerful way. Ah. Nice. Right. Maybe we should have this. <laughs> yes. Sure. Bam. Um, all right, next up. Pinky um, yellow one? Yellow makes, pink. Right. Yellow makes pink. me angry to hold you this. Do. That's normal. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah Yes, it is. Um, I, I, if you put it in a, a, a bag or something, something that's not touching your, 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 your skin, right. the moment it comes away from your skin, you start to calm down again. Fascinating, isn't it? Yes. Uh, yellowy pink. Yellowy pink. I can finally get to Stop add her. something to my yep. inventory for the first time Smell in fucking bit. ages. You, you do a little taste, and yep. Cyril's looking down at you. Is that, what you got there, mate? <gasps> And then Mila goes back. <laughs> I like she just goes. No. <laughs> it's a potion to speak with animals. What? 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 What is it? <clears throat> uh, uh, th- th- this lets me speak with animals. Oh my god! Yes. We can both talk to animals at the same time. Cyril C- C- asked me what I have in my hand. He, he said uh, v- verbatim. What, 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 have, what have you got there, mate? That it's does... a potion that'll let me understand you. <laughs> right? I know. <laughs> Here's a bit of food. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. We can do it at the same time. Mm. That's very cool. Mm. Lovely. And then what's the last one? Uh, the, well, we've got two more. Oh, two more. Yep. It's your turn again. Right. Cloudy green potion. Lovely. Oh. Smells salty. Seaweed a little bit. Some dead fish in there as well. Um, Getting there's some... like big bubbles that's like... Nautical mm-hmm. vibes from this one. Oh, is it qu- quite a fragrant bouquet? Yes. Salty, fishy. Oh. Mm. Right, little taste. Cool. You taste and you don't feel particularly different, but those of you observant in Science Club notice just slight outlines of gills slowly appear and disappear on her neck. Don't yeah. think there's anything much different. What? You have gills. Ooh. You have two potions of water breathing. Are you playing slaps with Lovely. our own science club? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to teach you how to do a scientific experiment. Just hold your hands like this. <laughs> just, just quick. <laughs> and um, do um, for the last one is the orange smoky potion. Sure. Go for it. Alexi will... Hang on. Where are you standing? Where's everyone standing in relation at this point? So, so we're in a oh corner with God, each other. Oh God, it's gonna be fire, <laughs> They fucked off because they were being antisocial. So, yeah. And then Mayway yeah. got There's pissed a reason off for this. Mayway got pissed off because of it, so um, she's over here. You were Cons- over here playing patty cake with um, D22? Considering yeah. yeah, no, no, Matt, look with my point, pointer. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, sorry yeah, uh, considering things blow up in Science Club. That's why we move away from yeah, people. Yeah, we will be, like, here-ish. Can you see where I'm pointing? Uh, yeah, like, okay. Yeah, like away from the stuff oh, my, and um, the people. Yeah, echo yeah. be gone. Okay. Great. Yeah, that's Who? why Science Club is isolated. Things blow up in Science Club. Things blow up in Science Club. <laughs> Who's trying this? Ah! Alexi is. Okay. Let's do 20s. Make a constitution saving throw. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. Guidance, 15. Six. Wait, I can't go into it. It's not good. See? You gotta move um, your hand out of the way. Okay, come eight. on, again. Eight. Eight. Yeah. So you take a little bit and it's so hot as it comes down, you sort of like taking a little bit more than you meant to. Um, you immediately heck up. A small spout of fire comes out. I need you to make a dexterity saving throw, please. <gasps> and, uh, sure. And yeah, D22 and Mayway just kind of both go. <laughs> <laughs> Do you hit me That's while I, do that? I need you to uh, 16, roll yeah. 4d6 <laughs> fire damage, please. Things blow up in Science Club. Things <laughs> nice. blow up in Science Club. Uh, oh, God, that's not good at all. Um, 13 points of damage. So you take 13 points of fire damage as a spout of flame immediately comes out, everything's <laughs> smoking, and on top of that. Everything catches fire. Everything suddenly catches fire oh, in God. the back. 
Because I did say we were away from all the stuff. Oh, he's doing a thing. I'm doing a thing, it's alright. Yeah. He's do getting you, fuego. Do you, do you need a hand, buddy? No, no, I'm good, I'm good. Immediately, the old rotted wood <gasps> starts to catch blaze a little bit. I immediately cast Sleet Storm and douse the fire. Just one god! As quickly as it appears, it disappears. <laughs> Stop <laughs> laughing, Jeff. No, it's <laughs> yeah. Slightly singed and with smoke coming off the top of your ears. There's just there's just pouring like freezing rain in that corner on you and me, presumably now. Just science club. Science club. Oh. You have two uses of the fire breath potion left. Okay. Cool. But are you two okay? Oh, oh yes, yeah, we're doing the, the, right. Are you, are you all right? I, I mean, I, I, I rather, um, I rather quite badly got yeah, you. Yeah, sorry, it's, it's, I'm, I'll be all right. Oh, okay, fine. right. Uh, D twenty two and I were at the mouth. Your, your shoulders. I'm going to turn and look to see if anyone noticed just, like, the eruption of flame coming towards us. Make a perception check with disadvantage. I'm not listening. I'm looking. You're still Fuck, exhausted. Fuck, still exhausted. Shit. <laughs> oh. Um. Oh, actually, a 14 That's and good. 13, yeah, so one minute perception. So despite the sleet storm putting out, there is a large plume of smoke. Oh, but negative like... two, 11. Okay, there is a large plume of smoke coming up. You don't see a much movement, but you do see the smoke and it is rising quite high. Guys, maybe we should relocate. I think that's a fantastic yeah, idea. Yeah, probably good, because yes. this is covering the ground in ice. I'm sorry about that. Dee and I were making our own science club. You see that Mayway's hand is like purple from being <laughs> smacked. What's inside here? Uh, Ow! Do not play slaps with the robot. <laughs> the wall forged. D20 is looking at the powder. Ow! Okay. okay. Um, and can I do a check, just a, che a check on trying to identify the powder? Sure, sure. Um, you can either do an arcana or you can do a history check. Please. I'm going to do an arcana. <coughs> Ooh. 20 unnatural. A dirty 20. Yeah. So. You you look at it Science and Club you scan two. through Arcana Club. <laughs> you you've seen a little bit of this before, like in some of the like more questionable areas of Thildaro. This seems to be more of a hallucinogenic, and you've sort of seen people more down their luck. You'll find them sometimes in the warehouse. Uh, they'd be just passed out, breathing with like little blue pus coming out their nose. Um, it's known mm. as blue root. Mm -hmm. This this particular dust, it's a hallucinogenic that helps people rest. Mm -hmm. And gives them very pleasant dreams, but that's about all you know. What mm -hmm. is it? <laughs> uh, I have seen this before. Um, it is not very good for you. It can be a. It's an addictive substance. Oh, like a narcotic. Exactly oh. like that. I'm not unfamiliar. What kind of a narcotic is it? Uh, I have never tried it myself, but uh, Aiden used to have quite a penchant for the stuff, and. We would see it come to and fro from time to time. Do you know what it's called? Uh, Blue root. It's called processing. <laughs> Blue root. Oh, that's can I? Of course. Would I have heard you of heard this? of this as well? Oh yeah, we sleeping. get that in Fildro. Yeah. Is it a bit too lowbrow for the car staffs? Yes. Yeah. No. Try some. I mean, good for sleeping. So I'm gonna wait until we relocate, and then I will. Mm -hmm. Do you want to try some too? Yes. Yeah. All right. We'll Why try not? it when we get to the next place. That's their version of Science Club. That, that, that's fine. It's, it seems like um, Cool Kids what, Club. <laughs> we called Arcana Club. Right. It, it seemed more like Narcotics, not Anonymous, but that, that, that's. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, Arcana Club is only for you know <laughs> people who have been to the Library of the Fell and know lots about Arcana. Hopefully, I'm old enough now to try it. I was always told I was too young. No. Well, your daddy's not here now. He can't control you. This is Maybe sad. Make the your truth. own choices. Toddlers. <laughs> All right, but really, we should move. Yes. Um, yes. We right. Go. Okay. We yeah. thought. Well, we were going to try and maybe find some caves or something down in those woods about a mile away. Should we go? Have, yes, have a go we'll, 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 yeah, we'll, we'll go do so that. Find somewhere? Uh, yeah, sure. so gather all the stuff and. Okay. Um, I'm aware that I've had a long rest. May I do an infusion? Please? Yes, you may. What would you like to infuse? Um, D22? I'd like to have. Uh, well, it says I need a rod, a staff, or a wand. So I'd be willing to use the rod. Like, can I use like the kind of wooden bit of my arm? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can um, I just check what infusions do you currently have? I'd like active? to have enhanced in arcane focus. Okay, Ooh, please. <laughs> but just just to ask what what, what do you already have because you've done a few infusions already. So I have uh, I can have four, right? I've got the 
I've got um, my homunculus servant. D2. I've got my moral compass, yep. which again is an infusion. Um, and you've got your crossbow. And I believe I've got a plus one on my fire. I've got a fire additive to my crossbow. Which I yeah, think that's I'm not a plus one. I think it's just a bonus D4 of damage. It is bonus D4. Yep. Shoulder um, no, the shoulder cannon. That's just an artillerist yeah. uh, feature. And I believe, I believe that's it. So this would be my last God, slot. God, you're a fucking walking armory. So your hat. My hat. Your moral homunculus. Compass. Oh, so the, but the hat, the hat is the homunculus. Um, I'm going to say there's a two item, sorry, mate. Because the hat is a separate attack to the homunculus, which can do different things. It's too powerful otherwise. So you'll need to drop one of those. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you so see D22 sort of processing, like mm. holding these things in his hands, trying to... Do you know what? <clears throat> the, hat, the hat has served a purpose. Um, and D22 needs to start learning some... Some spells and okay. some magic. So he's going to retire the hat from the attack. Keep it as a monk. Yep. You can still use it as a slashing weapon if you want to. You just can't do the Captain America throwing thing yeah. anymore. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's absolutely fine. Cool. He's, he's grown. He's going to lose that. And yeah, I'd like to have enhanced I kind of focus, please, using using my arm. Um, and as you can do it, as you, as, you, as you see him doing it, perhaps, you see that he's got a signet ring on the exact same finger that Alexi wears his, and he's very crudely tried to, um, with a screwdriver, just uh, copy or mimic the, the house crest uh, of Alexi on his, uh, on his wrist. Okay, That's make either, his, his no, finger. no, no, it's great. Can you make either a dexterity or a sleight of hand check? Just, just to see, and if you don't already, you can add your proficiency bonus, because I feel like this would come under workman's schools. I want to see if you could actually, like, mimic this. So sleight of hand, I'm, I'd be happy to do sleight of hand. Go for it, yeah, because it's quite a finesse little detail. <clears throat> No. Oh my god, I got a three bit with a, with a plus six, so I got a nine. It's it's a toddler's approximation of the you know like you get a child to like draw your country's flag? It's it's exactly like that of like the crest of house car stuff. Yes. Mm -hmm. And what, would I be able to, just as a little add-on, would I be able to use some, uh, my, my spells obviously come from, I get the arcane focus with the arm, but would I be able to go through the ring? Absolutely. Absolutely. Perfect. Just remember if you That's lose it. Yep. Yep. And we'll just make sure that if you lose your arm, then you lose some spell capability. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah yep. Just, just a note for next time. Mm -hmm. Um. Let's leave <laughs> this place. Yeah. Stealthily. Uh, can you get perception checks from everyone, please? Perception. All right. Sixty. Oh. Oh, Aww. that's very high. Mm. This one's been bad. Eleven. Twenty-one. Oh, fucking hell. Nice. Seven. <clears throat> Seven. As you as you head out and onto the roads, now are you heading towards Milford or are you heading up to the mountains, following where the cavalry went last no, night? No, it was so there was the other option. Uh, there was some caves was that some, were still like, like an woods. hour or two there was away. Oh, okay, yeah. that were like a mile away. You want to head further those, yeah. further into the wilderness away yeah. from everything else? Yeah, sure, absolutely, you can do that. Um, well, given Mayway, Mayway's exhaustion, her speed, is, her speed is hard. So what I will say, especially with that twenty-one, you do notice in the distance um, four figures on horseback. Roughly riding in your direction in reaction to the smoke. Guys, we, uh, should we shouldn't hide. go this way. Uh, yeah, maybe we should go up the mountain instead. All, all right. Um, Something stealthy. Let's go up the mountain. Um, <sighs> Someone help me. We. <laughs> I'm fine. Sure. I'm fine. I can. Up and carry you. <laughs> can he do that? Uh, make a strength check. Sure. Wouldn't that, yeah, wouldn't that uh, put not his with, movement in half? Not with all the gear you're also carrying at the same time. Yeah. And you yeah. drop Mayway or the floor. <laughs> Gear or Mayway? May Mayway or the gold. That, those are your options. Yeah, I go to pick up Mayway and then I'm just check it. No, no, it's okay. Sorry. It's all right. I can, I can, I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. Myla is going to cast Pass Without a Trace. Ooh. Pass Without a Trace. We're getting to that section of the. Uh, Great right, skill. Great spell. Such a then, good spell. Wild shape into. Could Mayway ride like a leopard or something? No, I think we've established that she could, like we can't have things ride like leopards and stuff. Not a leopard. It would need to be a. Thank you. It needs to be a larger, a larger creature. Bear. Bear. Bear would be great. Yep. Bear would work. I'll be a bear. <laughs> oh. Oh, or what? Can I do like a large wolf yet? I don't remember. Can you do dire stuff? Like yeah. dire stuff. Yeah. Um. <laughs> also, in this moment, Alexi, I really. I'd li I like that ring a lot for what 
You say it describes. Oh, um, do you think you'll ever be punching people? No, I can't do well, dieting. Yeah. Probably I'll not. Be a bear. Seems terribly a bear or a horse. Yeah, that's, that's completely fine. I like bear. Yes, I know you do. What particular kind of bear? Can I hear it? <laughs> the ring of punching. You're not allowed to punch me with it. Okay. Deal. Well, whilst they're walking and talking about rings, and um, D22 is just doing that thing where he's kind of scratching his head, just to kind of, just to kind of hope that you'll catch a glimpse of the. Um... <laughs> is that? Oh, what this old thing? <laughs> Have you? Is, is that the? Is that the house cast out sigil? Yes, correct. I made it. Oh yes, the, that's the that's oh, the. That's why it hurt so much when you fucking hit me. You meant to take your rings off when you play that game. Ah, right. Um, uh, lovely. Mm. I figured that as a part of you was literally inside me when you decided to <laughs> give yourself up for us, that I was officially a member of House Cast Off. I, I I don't I I don't have the authority to do that. Um. Uh, if if we do, um... oh, I look. Steve looks no, 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 uh, no, 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 sad and wait, kind wait, of wait, decides wait, to ring no, off. No, 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 don't wait. You can you can put it, put, put it back. Um, if 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 we do, um, you know, uh, d- d- go to my home and, and 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 deal with my family. That seems like a strange thing to say. Um, you know, if if I ever am uh, the ruler of Coldhaven, then you you will absolutely be adopted into House Castaff. I'm a member of House Castaff. I will I will make you one one day. So I am already. Already this now. Uh, uh, um, yeah, 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 let's go with yes. You're, you're, you're my. Um, you're, you're, you can be my my valet. Great. Great. Uh, uh, I, uh, he, he, he made him happy. Uh, okay. All right. But you're not his servant. You're not my servant. Which is what a valet is, right? No, no. Yeah, yeah but your your valet means ser- to serve. Uh, not not exactly. It's more like um um. It, it, it's a bit of a complicated point. Uh, essentially, yes. But but you're not going to be my servant. An arrow flies over your heads as you guys are running and going. Mm. You hear shouts in the back in dwarven French accent. Stop them! Stop them! Uh, you look back. You see four dwarves in blue armor, still a ways back, but oh, you are oh, currently being chased. The... This is the... What would you like to do? Uh, okay, so we're heading into the mountains. They're on horseback, right? You've got Pass Without a Trace if you need Bronze it. Blues. That's what these fuckers Bronze are blues. called. They are on horseback, did you say? Yes. Um, okay, they're on horseback. Are we're you a dire the bear? Mountains. No, I'm just a bear. Okay, cool. I'm a I black bear. slump over the side of Mila and kind of... To, you know... And considering we have Pass Without a Trace, I will, yeah, I want to head up in further into the rocks so the horses should really, if it's getting to be really rocky terrain, be more You're of a hindrance. You're definitely getting more rocky terrain and, and the slope oh, is okay. starting to work its way up now as well. How far back are they? Uh, you can stop my perception check if you'd like to get a good gauge. I don't want to stop. Well, there we go then. I say we try and hide. Yep. Fine yeah, with me. Because, yeah. Cool, uh, cool, you get up ahead. Cool, you get up ahead, you arrive at this sort of rocky terrain. Can you get the uh, bear mini, please? You absolutely can. Thank you very much. Would, would you like a smaller one? Uh, I, I, I have uh, multiple bear options. Ah, uh, there's, uh, there's good. Poop? Here, have three bears. <laughs> so you can decide exactly three, which mile would you like. Three whole bears. Oh, you have no idea how excited sure. this ring of punching is making me. Look okay, at this one green eyes. It's one too big, one too small, one just right. Yep. <laughs> right, you all sort of arrive at this moment, you've got maybe not that long. Hide. Mm. Cool. Uh, I need to know where each of you are hiding. All of you come hide uh, around the back of Mala. here. Yeah. 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 I'm just on her back, so she takes yeah, yeah, yeah. me and cool. I try. Are we, are we hiding? Are we sitting in ambush? What are we? What are we doing? What's the plan? hiding? Cool. We're mm-hmm. all just hiding. Cool. The bear quickly sprints ahead, hiding in the back. You two, all, all, all four of you, hiding yep. on that one side. Yep. Cool. Um, how high is the rock? How high is the rock? Mm-hmm. Uh, you'd be looking at. Probably about 15-ish feet, maybe a little bit more. Okay. Just for future. Um, I'm going to summon my Echo and she's going to hide behind with us. Oh, I so. can climb 30 feet as a bear. We're going up the rock. I mean, I, w- I think that's a great idea. Just would they be able to see us? If we can just easier? get up into it a little bit. Okay. That's what I'm, I was most thinking, just get up high, try and like nestle in some nooks. Mm. The bear's going up. The bear's going up. Okay. Uh, cool. I need you... 
No, we'll make it a free action. That's completely fine. You can hang on. Cool, the beer's going up. In fact, if I've got time, I'll deposit Mayway. I've got a 30 foot climbing speed. Yep. I will just, I'll start shuttling them up and down. Anyone who doesn't climb. You can choose two people. I can choose two people. So I've got Mayway up there. Yep. Uh, I've got decent acrobatics, so I'm going to try and head up by myself. Okay. Okay. I'll take... you're, okay. I'm just going to say you can either ah. hide. Yeah, you're okay. You can either hide or you can climb the rock. You cannot do both. Oh, okay, cool. In that case, we'll just hide. I was thinking we could try oh, yeah. and like, hide, hide up and cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We'll great. just hide. All right. Um, I'm One gonna... of you can climb up and still. So if you want to climb up, you can hide on top of the rock instead if you'd rather do that. But you can't ferry people up and do the stuff. Uh, they'll still be within my. They'll still be within your. Pass that trace. 30 foot. Or is it 15 foot? Pass that trace. I should know this. I didn't realize we were on this so soon. It's. Within 30 feet, yeah, it's completely fine. Great. So in that case, yeah, the bear will go up the top. Anyone who wants to join the bear can, but like, I will be hiding cool. at the top. Um, my echo will join her at the top, so if they find us, I will. Swap places with her and bam sure. up. Can I get stealth checks from everyone, please? And you can add a bonus plus ten yep. to your roll as well. So disadvantage, but with plus ten. Straight roll plus ten for us. So stealth checks, yeah. so normal stealth checks, mm -hmm. and whatever plus your bonuses plus ten again. Wow. You're welcome. Wow, so thirty-five. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's <laughs> you roll a natural twenty. Nineteen. Oh, I've got oh. plus six. Twenty-one. Cool. Um, oh god, yeah. Uh, 2934. We are so stealthy, it's unreal. Healthy and stealthy. stealthy. <laughs> 21. 21? With disadvantage? Yep, cool. I rolled a 3, but I have plus 7. <laughs> plus 10. For my that would be 20. 20. So 20. Uh, dirty. So 3, three plus, seven plus, plus 7 plus 10. Yes, yeah, sorry. 20. Cool. Not a problem. Not a problem. What did you get? 21. <laughs> Lovely, yeah. You guys wait about 30 seconds, and then on horseback, I'm sorry, I don't have horses. 30 uh, Four figures do. Suddenly up here. So it comes this way. So it cannot have gone far. Um, can I get you to roll for your echo as well, please? This can just be a straight stealth roll. With the same plus ten. Plus ten. Sure. Nice. Uh seventeen, plus seven, twenty-four, cool. plus ten, thirty-four. Same as me? All right. She just basically blends in with the shadows at that. She is the shadows. Yeah, she exactly. is the shadows. Okay, we're gonna do perception checks now. As they come and slowly start looking around. It's a natural one. Come on. <laughs> they slowly start to inch their way in between the rocks. Slowly on horseback. Keeping an eye out above. Two more looking ahead as well. None of you make a sound or a peep. Two carry on forward. One more carries on forward. Another one, thinking they hear something. Stops and waits for a moment. One more round of stealth checks for everyone, please. Uh, do I have to roll yeah, for the Hang on, hang on. Well? Come on again. With the same bonus, do we? Yeah, same bonus. Still get plus 10. So do I um, roll for the echo separately? <sighs> Separate echo, yes, please. And she doesn't have disadvantage, but I do. Oh, wow. <laughs> Correct. Okay, so me first. Um, uh, 21. Yeah. 21 for me, mm -hmm. and then for echo. Ooh, 19. 19. 20. Natural? No. Dirty? Guy and I have both rolled natural ones. <laughs> For a total of? Well, I mean, it's a total for me of... 17. Uh, 16. Kind of an upgrade. It's a big fucking bad. <laughs> it's one roll. Go on, so what roll. was the lowest there? 16, 16. was it? 16. Okay, so I need to roll a 15 mm -hmm. or higher. I'm going to do this in front of you. Can you move oh, your mark, please? One. Of course. One, one, one. Four. Four. Yes! He stops for a moment. And he hears some movement or some shouting up ahead as the other three start to canter and take off. Wait, wait, wait for me, wait for me! Get up to me. <sighs> Suck a dick! <laughs> Does Alexa actually say that? Yeah. Hanging out with Mayway too much right there. <laughs> Do you know what's devastating? Is if they'd spotted us, I would have been a drop there. 
in my head. What's the opposite of inspiration? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to impose disadvantage at one point. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> like a monkey's paw. At one point, there'll be a disadvantage no. roll. Their armor is glinting in the late afternoon sun, but quickly riding in the distance. Um, you do also spot, I assume you're waiting a moment, or are you mm. following yeah, yeah. quite quickly? They soon dismount their horses and start working their way deeper into the mountain instead. They knew they saw something. What would you like to do? Head back the other way, but still being stealthy. Not back. If they're heading further up, we kind of want to circle round. I was, I was thinking if they so if I was thinking if they've gone up, yeah. we can we can now just double back on where we were before and head out into that wilderness that we were going to go for before. Maybe. Looking, sorry, go on. No, maybe we could follow them because follow they them. work for Sarek. Yeah, yeah the maybe. hunted become the hunted. Uh, hunted and um, yes, hunter exactly. becomes the hunted. The hunted Bad. becomes the hunted. Yes. All right, I'm happy to follow them. That's fine. <sighs> We're not in much of a position to. You're very eloquent for a bear. Ah, yes, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not the time for more science club. <laughs> it's been about 20 minutes. What would you like to do? Uh, get rid of my echo. <laughs> they disappear. I, I was like dancing around. I still think bear. we should try and find somewhere around here to rest so we can all be a bit more. You're still not at long rest point yet. Yeah, yeah, I mean, just like. Well, maybe this something. could help. Little bag of blue powder. <laughs> <laughs> maybe not while we're being hunted. But when it's rest time. When it's rest time. Um, okay, maybe then. Maybe it could give us a long rest. Before it's <laughs> rest time. I'm, go- I'm, go- I'm going to ask you to put the drugs down. <laughs> <laughs> um, how m- do we know how many doses there are in there? You would need to test it to find out. Oh no. <laughs> I would like to look around to see if anyone else is following or if it's just them. Sure, make a perception check. <laughs> it takes it, it just passes out. 18. 18? You, you do a cursory scan, watching the horizon. Doesn't seem to be much in the way of movement. Um, Whoever this group is seems like they were sent out to investigate. Yeah. But given how quiet the road had been as well, you're pretty confident this is it. Ignore me. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, all right, well, I guess we... Keep on the move. So we're following them then? Mm. Stealthily. Stealthily, yes. So are we tracking? D22. Mm -hmm. Just realized you're meant to be rolling disadvantage with stealth because of your armor. My bad. So it's also my bad for forgetting. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to get you to roll 1d20 for me. Just Mm -hmm. just, just at a, a single roll. Six. Plus. Uh, my stuff is quite good. Uh, plus six, twelve total. Plus and then 10. plus ten, yeah. You're fine. Twenty-two. Cool. Ooh. With a dirty twenty-two, you're still okay. Yay! Right. Uh, I'll remember, please, yeah, stealth at disadvantage for you moving forward. Um, God, pass without a trace is so good. It's mm. broken. Um, it's also going to last for ten minutes. With the waiting time, pass without a trace is now ended unless you decide to cast it again. The horse is now left, and they are probably about 300, 350 feet ahead of you. What happens next? Uh, pass without a trace lasts for an hour. Well, poop. Where do I see ten minutes? Actually, Matt. <laughs> actually, actually, I think um, you'll find actually. it does. It's it's an hour, so carry on. You're still under it. We need to keep going up this way anyway. Um, this this is the route to up top, isn't it? No, no. You're heading into the mountains. Up top would be north. You're heading east. Sir Rick, Sir Rick. Which way did D twenty two see people running to for, for Sarek? This way. Roughly this way. But they were taking the road, not the side path like you guys are taking. So if the road was directly east, mm. you're roughly heading sort of southeast, veering away from that a little bit. Okay. Yeah. Um, Thank you. I, I say we move um, parallel to the road. Um, stay in the rocks, stay hidden, but very much keep going in this direction. Right. If you want to head to the caves, the caves sort of said that's probably a little bit more southeast. So heading towards the road, you'd be moving away from the caves. But you're more than welcome to do. Caves. I'm going to take that as a yes. <laughs> Great. Uh, we'll, we'll go to the caves. Um, you know, we can sort of. Uh, I know it's still a bit of time, but we can rest there because we we need to get you back in fighting shape before we. I'm fine. Uh, yeah. I can fight him right I now. I believe you. I got this ring of punching. So tempted to take that back. Right. Okay. I um, mean, you could try. You're not allowed to remember. You promised. Mm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Wait, I'm that, that. take the flail. <laughs> I have other ways. Touche. <laughs> yeah, 400 feet away, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, let, let's, let, let's go to the caves. Sure. Right, um, Mayway, do you want to hop back on uh, Bear Myla? Uh, I mean, sure, just because she's so kindly offered. <laughs> um, we're going to, we'll, we'll try and do this as stealthy as we can. Um, uh. Yes, and healthy. Uh, yeah, so, so the, towards the caves, I know it's going to be disadvantage and disadvantage, but stealthily if we can. Cool. Good as gold. Yeah. Make your stealth checks, <laughs> lads and ladies. Ooh. Uh, 29. Cool. We've got the bonus still. Yep. Nice. 30, 30 22. 30, 25. D 22. D22. Cool. <laughs> and, sorry. Uh, 20. Maybe? 20. You move through the rocks, cutting in between and sort of knowing their patterns and being able to see them and you can sort of gauge when to stop them going. You approach the cave without any sort of harassment or Great. anything at this point. Moving quite quickly. Uh, it's been about another 20 minutes, so 20 minutes left on your polymorph. I'm going to do one more round of stealth checks. They're about 500 meters away at this point. <coughs> 500 feet, sorry, not meters. Uh, you don't mean on my polymorph, you mean on Path Without a Trace. Correct. My wild shape has ages left. That's what I meant, yes. <laughs> another stealth check. 19. Another stealth check, right? Uh, another stealth check. Last stealth 24. check. 24. 24. Nice. That's cocked, thank God. 25. Uh, 10. Dirty 20. Dirty 20. Uh, the previous one was cocked between a 1 and a 13 on either side. It was just like. What, what was the lowest roll on that, sorry? 19. 19. During the last sort of pray, press, and you can see the cave, it's quite close at this point. You slip just a little bit, and some rocks start to scatter down. Oh no, I didn't get a 19. Got 19. I got the 19. I'm on the bear. You slip off the bear a little bit before oh. pulling it off back up, knocking some rocks and falling. Milo corrects for you. But yeah, it's because like, I'm so tired and like slide off yeah. of it and then and I don't have a saddle, so it's a bit like ooh. Cursory glance, nothing seems to immediately happen, but you carry on. It's quiet. You don't hear anything else though. Because they're too far away. Excellent. You're dead, I knew it. You arrive at the cave. And quickly, do you go in or do you want to head out front? It's about I mean, I'm 30 on a feet. Bear, it's quite, it's quite so a large opening. The bear is going to have a sniff of the cave. Okay. Very specifically sniffing. Make <laughs> a perception check, and I'm assuming you have advantage. I do. <laughs> that is fine. <laughs> fine. Fine. I do. Great. Right. Well love that done. For us. Yeah. Uh, right, hang on. Sixteen. Sixteen. Sixteen? Sixteen. Smells reasonably, reasonably, uh, like, not that like cold has a smell, but you know, like that cold sort of like fresh sort of feeling, like cold ice rock. is sort of like, cold yep. rock, like ice is sort of gathered on, on the back. Nothing sort of catches, very sort of like dead air on the inside, nothing's blowing in or out. So you do get the indication that this is not a through passage, at least from what you can tell at this sort of point. But you don't smell any sort of particular creature or anything sort of like waiting inside. Mm. Nothing dead or dying either. The bear's gonna start making its way in. Uh, Alexi will draw the um, short sword and walk in tandem with the bear. Cool. D22, what are you doing? Mm, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna follow, I think. Cool. So D22 was at least a bit distracted by looking at his ring. That's genuinely true as well. <laughs> <laughs> I was planning it. Uh, so yeah, I just wanna. I want to follow my crew. D22 is looking down at his feet, and he wasn't paying attention. He's been caught off guard. Good as gold, Mayway. Is schlumped on the bear's <laughs> back schlumped still? As you're schlumped, just like like just super tense. Like will not slide off there again. And so as you head inside the cave, I mean, does anyone object? No, no, no. no. Great. Uh, Alexi will have opinions, but uh, <laughs> all right, he has opinions about a lot of things. And so as you head inside, seemingly safe. Unsure how those rolls and how stealthy you really were up until that point. You arrive inside where it's not warm, but it is dry, and you are at least out of the elements at this point. 
Um, I'm, I'm tired. Do, do we think that I could maybe try to get some sleep? I, 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 I think you need it. Me too. Is that okay? Hmm. I'll, um, I'll set up. Can we sort of like, a, does the cave is just straight or does it go curve around at it's, all? It's, it's very dark um, and it dips down a little bit as well as you sort of head inside. But at this point, it's quite, it's quite a straight sort of opening. Okay, so Alexa point. will probably want us all to go in sort of to the dip bit, yeah, so sure. it, you can't just look straight in and see us. And he's going to sort of like sit up by the top of that, and Are you he's going to sort of yeah, yeah. Kind of yeah. The, the, gonna the, the, the bear is going to go as well and be like mm, <laughs> on the I at least the rock. the top of that. It's a great visual, just the, the two of yeah. you. Yeah. Good. And they're both gone. All right. Well, yeah. I was going to talk to them about this, but they <laughs> left. So <laughs> I pulled the pouch out because yeah. I've taken it before. I know it's good for sleeping. Oh, D20 for you. You've taken this before. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's a drug commonly found in the vow. My way has taken it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so. Good. Then you are not allowed to act surprised when I tell you what happens. So. Well, no, I was gonna. Take a big snort then, if you want. No. <laughs> <laughs> How do you take the drug? Describe it to me. Fearfully now. Um, used to the shit. Yeah, well, of course I am. But I was assuming that because I said that, the, D- the DM would be like, well, you know how it works because you've done it before. It's Matt. <laughs> I just want you to describe how you take it. How have I taken it in the past? It's something you snort. It is something you, you <laughs> breathe in. Mayway brings up a little credit card. <laughs> <laughs> no, don't do drugs, kids. No, don't do drugs. Don't do drugs, kids. Don't do drugs. You, you... Only if you need help sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> You you anyway. pull out the bag and you you you've managed to fill it out and you know there are about four doses mm-hmm. in here. You do pull out your dagger. Okay. Because you don't have another flat surface to put it on and you pour it on a little bit. You put the pouch down. Yeah. You tip the dagger into your hand until it's cupped. Mm-hmm. And you breathe in and you breathe in deep. And immediately it hits your senses and your mind goes to bright white and memories come flooding in. Mostly happy, mostly you know, time with your parents, time with your with your with your entire family, your 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 best days in the library. And as you sort of breathe it in, you relax and you feel yourself sort of fall into it like a soft heap. D twenty two, if you're watching this, you'll notice Mayway breathes it in, slumps, falls to the floor, and is now fast asleep with a giant smile on her face and blue smoke slowly wafting out of her nose as she begins to take a magically induced rest. And that is where we're going to end tonight's episode. What have you done? (laughs) I'm going to wake up with no points of exhaustion now. I'm going to wake up addicted to blue (laughs) roots. Well, we'll certainly find out. We'll find out. In like a month or so. Uh, We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Anyway, thank you so much. Uh, We're going to wrap it up there. Another good little episode. Look, I didn't even try to kill anyone. I need to make better mimics. Apparently, that was. I've been sitting. I've been. We'll talk about this in the post. We'll talk about this in the post show. Mm. Uh, yeah. Take care, Kakita. Um, and we'll see you again soon for the next exciting installment. Don't do drugs. Though, don't do drugs. Really, please. Do not. Don't do drugs you find in random bags and abandoned shacks that were guarded by Especially, by monsters. Yeah. Don't yeah. do drugs found inside a monster. Yeah. 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 That's a choice. Look. Look at the color of his tongue. What do you What do you think? Was that? It's, it's all good. Uh, anyway, <laughs> they were having a great kit before. We yeah, did. really were. They really were. <laughs> Thanks so much, and we'll see you next time. Bye. 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 Jesus Christ. David, can you just come stand here, just so I can, um, you can just have your thighs against the table for me, and I'll just check my focus. Oh, baby. <laughs> Pardon? Do you need a phone charger? Put no, your thighs good, against thank you very much. the table. The table. Hi, I'm Butt Mateman. <laughs> <laughs> and my thighs are against the table. My thighs are, my balls are almost touching this laptop. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, oh. <laughs> Get your ass back. <laughs> if I was Guy Samuels right now, <laughs> they would get some backdrop, David. It's like blindingly um, white. That against that one.